so much to learn about. It'll make you want to shout, Flippy! <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy! And look at this giant box! <laughs> yeah, today, Mika and I have some exciting things planned. But he was supposed to meet me here by now. Hmm. Huh, I wonder where Mika went. Hmm. Did you hear something? It sounded like a doorbell. <laughs> oh, look, there's a doorbell. Hmm, let's try to press it. <laughs> I wonder who's home. Hi, I'm Mika. Nice to meet you. And this is my best friend, Blippi. <laughs> and we have work to do. We do? Uh huh. Have you told them what we're doing today? Oh yeah, <laughs> silly me, I kind of forgot. Yeah, we're using everything in these boxes uh -huh. to build an epic awesome Ooh, fort! Yes! Woo! Forts are so cool! <laughs> I think a great fort needs three things. <gasps> a cool way to get in, an awesome way to get out. Yeah, and something unique to make it special. Uh -huh. <laughs> exactly. Ooh, we have to use our creative thinking. <laughs> How's this floor plan, Blippi? Hmm. You can go through my purple box and get some building ideas. Ooh! Oh, and Mika, you can go through my orange box and get some fun, creative ideas, too. <laughs> Three, two, one! Woo! <laughs> Pool <Ooh>, noodles! PVC pipe? Oh! Ooh, that'll be a fun plastic pipe where we can maybe da, hang da, da, da. something. <laughs> or use it as a trumpet. And, whoa, we can use a this case. as uh, a superhero case. <laughs> yeah, super <laughs> or blippy. maybe just the roof. <laughs> well, I think we better get started building this fort. Let's do it! <laughs> working on the door right here, but there's nothing to attach the door to. Whoa! <laughs> so we can build a very fun door frame by stacking up these blocks. Woohoo! <laughs> Woohoo! One door frame post. <laughs> now we just need the other side. And we have finished the other side. We'll just put it right there whoop, <laughs> and attach the door. You see? I put some string and some cardboard here with tape so it can swing open on a hinge. <laughs> Check it out, we did it! Woohoo! Look at the door! The front door to our fort! Hey, Mika, I finished the door. <laughs> hey, Blippi, it looks great. Ha, huh, thanks. Oh, and Mika, did you know that the world's largest doors are at the Kennedy Space Center? Yeah, they're 456 feet tall or 138 meters. <laughs> Whoa, that's taller than the Statue of Liberty. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> well, I'll see you inside. Okay, I have a surprise for you. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, Mika, a ball pit? Yes, I made a ball pit for us to splash around in in our fort. Whoa, that sounds like fun. <laughs> I made it out of some plastic pipes, oh. and 
I put a sheet over it, just like this. Whoa, it's looking really great, Nika. You did a good job. Oh, thank you, friend. Whoa. And I have some clips in my jam pack. Clip that together. Clip this over here. <laughs> and then we take some pillows for some nice cushions. Whoa, it's looking really great and nice and soft, so you don't bump your head. <laughs> Would you like to help me with the finishing touches, Blippi? Oh, yeah, I'd love to. Okay. Let's put this last bag of balls in there. Whoa, check it out! Ball pit balls! Ball okay, pit balls! Here we go! Zip, <laughs> zip, zip! 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 Whoa, whoa! Here we go! Whoa! Whoa! Whoa. Okay, whoa. one last thing to do. Mm, what's that? Jump inside! Whoa! 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 Yeah. <laughs> well, we've done a really good job making our fork. <laughs> we did. Oh. It looks amazing. Mm -hmm. And it has two of the three things great forks have. Mm -hmm. A cool entrance. That's the door. <laughs> yeah. And something unique. The ball pit. Woo! Woo! <laughs> we just need a really fun exit. Oh, I have a great idea. Oh. Wait right here, Blippi. Okay. I'll be back. <laughs> I wonder what Mika's idea is. Hmm. Whoa. Look, I found this in the backyard. Whoa, a ladder? Yes, some stairs for a slide. Whoa, a slide? That would be such a good idea for an exit. Well, well we have the stairs and, and the slide, mm -hmm. and we have some tools to put it all together. Oh, okay, well, let's put it together maybe over there. Okay. Here we go. Whew. Great idea. Time to build. Here you go, <laughs> hammer for you and a hammer for me. Wow, it's looking really great, Mika. Yep. Now we just need to adjust it so it's the exit. Great. Wow, Whoa. that's awesome. Mm. And I think there's only one last thing to do now. Slide? Slide. You can go first. Okay, here you go. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Time to slide. <laughs> Yay. Woo. Woo. Great job, friend. Okay, here I go. <laughs> Whee. Whoa, Mika, that was awesome! That was Whoa. so much fun! We did it! We made our fort so, so <laughs> awesome! And we got all the parts finished. <laughs> Whoa, the only thing left is to dance now. Okay! Dance party! Woo! -hoo! Woo, -hoo! Woo, -hoo! Woo -hoo! Now that we built our fort, what should we do? Oh, I know. Let's play some fort games. Whoa, I love <laughs> playing games. Do you think we should play a fort game together? <laughs> yeah, that sounds like fun. <laughs> so what should we play? Uh, oh, how about we play hot and cold? Oh, I like that game. Is that where <laughs> someone hides a dinosaur uh -huh. <laughs> and the other person tries to find it and they get hints that are either hot or cold uh -huh. if they're close or far away. That's exactly <laughs> it, Blippi. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like a fun game. Well, who should go first? How about I hide the dinosaur first and you can find him? Okay, okay. I'm gonna go <laughs> out there so you can hide it and then tell me when you're done. Okay, Blippi. <laughs> See you later. Here we go. <laughs> okay. Where should we put the dinosaur? Okay, Blippi. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Well, now we have to find the dinosaur. Okay, I'll look, see where it might be. Hmm. You're cold, just like Antarctica. <laughs> okay, over here. You're still pretty cold. <laughs> Maybe it's over here. Oh, but you're getting warmer. Don't see it over here either. But you're getting kind of hot. Whoa. Hot like a volcano. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> Look, I found it! It's our dinosaur! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, Mika. Well, now how about I hide the dinosaur and you go outside so oh. that I can hide it? Okay, friends! Okay, see ya. See ya. <laughs> Whoa, I wonder where we should hide this. Mika was really good at hiding you. Hmm. No, just the place.
Okay, Mika, I'm all done. <laughs> well, let's see if Mika can find the dinosaur. Where'd that dinosaur go? <laughs> okay, you're getting cold, like a cold frozen smoothie. Okay. <laughs> yep, you're still cold like Ooh. ice. Still cold. <laughs> you are as cold as an ice cube. Cold. As cold as <gasps> a giant, giant refrigerator freezer. Whoa, you're getting warmer. Love it? You're getting really warm. Hmm, maybe like a warm, toasty panini. <gasps> oh, oh, yum. Whoa, you're getting hot like a bowl of soup. Oh. Or hot like, like lava. lava. Or hot like the sun. Or a star. Is the dinosaur in here? <laughs> you're getting really, really hot, but you gotta keep looking. <laughs> okay. Whoa, I think we did a good job. <laughs> you did a really great okay, job. Okay, cold, warmer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Woo, you got it. This calls for a 10 second dance party. Dance party. Woo, we did yeah. it, we did Woo. it. We never ever quit Whoa. it, we did it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whoa, oh, Mika, that was fun. Well, is there another game you think we can play together? Ooh, let's build an obstacle course. Oh, that's a great idea. Mm -hmm. An obstacle course is where you put up different objects. Obstacles. Yeah, obstacles. <laughs> things you might have to climb over or climb under or roll around. Oh, and we can time each other. Maybe Mika, you can grab some blocks. Here. This is gonna be one fun obstacle course. Okay. Whoa! Okay, so here's how it goes. First, you need to walk over the pillow path. Then, roll over this big red tunnel. bumpy block. Yeah, and it's a tunnel, so then go under it, through the couch maze, into the ball pit, and... Uh -huh. Down the slide! <laughs> yeah! Okay, <laughs> I'm ready to time you, Mika. Are okay. you ready? Yep. Set, go! Uh -oh. <laughs> Whoa, Mika! Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> that was fun! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Pop it! Yeah! Whoa. Whoa, keep going, Mika! You're so close to the finish line! Whoa! Whoa! Mika, you did it! Whoa, you were really fast at that obstacle course. Thanks, man. But I think it's my turn now. Okay. There you go. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> oh, there you go. <laughs> it was stuck on my hand. <laughs> All right, let me reset the watch. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> okay. Okay, on your mark. Get set. Go. Okay, here, over the over pillow the path. Over the bridge. Whoa. Whoa, you look like a turtle. <laughs> <laughs> from obstacle courses. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> yeah, well, we had so much fun and we built this amazing fort. Yes. Mika, you have such creative ideas. Oh, thank you, Blippi. <laughs> so do you. And I love learning that the biggest doors are at the Kennedy Space what? Center. And they're bigger than the Statue of Liberty. Whoa, that's really big. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of our videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with us? Okay, here we go. Ready? B L I P P I Blippi. <laughs> Good job. Can you spell my name with us? Great. M E E K A H. -E -E Mika. <laughs> well, we'll see you soon. Bye bye. bye I'm driving a real race car. Yeah! Hey! It's me, Flippy! 
Hey! And hey, it's me, Mika! You see what I see? <gasps> Whoa! A giant racetrack! <laughs> We're at the Daytona International Speedway! In Daytona meets Florida? <laughs> and hey, Fluffy, look! Race cars! They're so colorful! <laughs> I think we should take a closer look. Yeah! See, Flippy? Real race cars! Oh! Oh, wait a minute. Mika, these are toy race cars! Well, they look much bigger from far away. Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> wait a minute. Well, anyway, something we can do with these cars is race! Look! Okay. They're remote controlled! Cool! Whoa, here's one for me and, and one, one for you. me! I probably should put this down. Yes! <laughs> okay, on your mark! Get set! And go! Go! I'm gonna get you, Mika! No, <laughs> you're not! I'm in the lead! No. <laughs> I'm right behind you! Woo. I'm right behind you! Whee. Whoa! Oh. It looks like A it's, best friend tie! It's a tie! Yeah. <laughs> oh, hey! Okay, this time I do see a real race car. Really? Uh-huh. We should probably go take a closer look then. Yeah, follow me! Okay. <laughs> See, I told you! A real race car! <laughs> yeah, Mika, you were right! <laughs> Whoa, and this looks like a really fast race car. Yeah, and look! Do you know this animal on front? Oh, Mika, I know this animal. <laughs> it's a horse! <laughs> 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 Whoa! Oh, but Mika, do you notice something? Oh, look. This grill is a sticker, Whoa. and these headlights are also stickers. Why? Huh. Well, they're stickers because you wouldn't want the headlights to be made of glass if you're racing. It's a lot safer if it's just a sticker. Oh, <laughs> yeah. First things first. Safety, Safety first. <laughs> Whoa, and check out this side of the race car. Cool. Whoa, look at it all. Whoa. Hey. <gasps> Do you see what color this race car is, Mika? Yeah, <laughs> two of my favorite colors. Purple and some yellow on the tires. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, yeah, and these wheels and tires look so big. Check yeah. it out. Whoa, they're really smooth. Ooh, I want to feel. You feel? Wow. Very smooth. <laughs> oh, yeah, and they're kind of hairy, too. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's funny. A real race car driver. Let's go say hi. Mm -hmm. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, check it out! <laughs> it's NASCAR Cup champion, oh, Joey Logano! Oh, oh, it's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you guys. Hello, I'm Mika. I know. <laughs> nice to see you. I watched this. Are you kidding me? It's <laughs> so nice of you. Well, we were learning all about racing today, and we noticed there are some race cars over here. What are they doing? Yeah, so right now they're going through tech. Oh. So what they have to make sure is that all the cars are the same. Oh. So so it's a fair race. So it's a fair race out there. So they have a lot of different things that they go through to make sure all the cars fit certain templates, certain uh, things. So not one car has way more horsepower than the other or way more downforce than another. Make sure they're the same weight, all those things. Ooh. Oh, what makes the car go fast? Horsepower. Oh. Big motors help. <laughs> <laughs> None of that kind of horse. <laughs> that kind of horse. Totally different kind of horsepower. Yeah. A little bit different. <laughs> they sound even louder. Oh, <laughs> so, yeah. Right Horsepower is big, uh -huh. downforce is big, right? So when the air is pushing down on the race car, that creates grip. Oh. So you want to have that, and you want to uh -huh. have not much drag. Oh. So you want the car to be able to go through the air without it pulling you back, or oh, without yeah. the wind pulling you back. So yeah. You Definitely don't want your car flying away. No, <laughs> no, no, no. It would not be good. <laughs> oh, and Joey, do you think you could maybe teach us what it takes to be a driver? I sure can. Okay, let's go. Woo! Come on. <laughs> Whoa! That was so cool learning all about your car. But Joey, what do you do before you race? Well, before you strap in the car for a long race, just like riding in the road in a car ride for a long time, you want to stretch out. Oh, so you okay. gotta maybe stretch your legs out a little bit. Sure. You want to cramp up while you're up there racing. So maybe <gasps> you touch your toes a little oh. bit you if you can. Oh, toe for me. <laughs> and your arms a lot. You're driving a lot, so your arms get tired. So you want to make sure you're okay. flexible with your arms. Yeah. Get it all stretched out there. Both arms, left and right. Yes, because we do turn right every now and again. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, and Joey, have you always wanted to be a race car driver? From as 
young as I can remember. I got a go-kart when I was six or seven. Whoa, and that's all young. I did when I got home from school. It was just make laps in the backyard. I tore up the yard. Whoa. The grass was gone. <laughs> but it was okay. Oh it later. worked out okay. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, have you driven in a go-kart before? <laughs> well, hey, maybe one day, who knows, you'll end up like this guy. Yeah, just like Joey. <laughs> well, Joey, that was so nice to meet you, and thank you for teaching us all about being a driver. Absolutely. I'm Good glad you just came by. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, and Joey, can we go drive a race car now? Well, I'd say before you go out there going 200 miles an hour, maybe check out the simulator first so you know where the turns are. You don't miss a turn going that far. Oh, that's yeah. a good idea. Yeah. A simulator so we can practice driving first. That's okay. right. We'll see you later. Bye, right. Joey. Bye, see you guys. Joey. Have a good one. Let's go. <laughs> check it out. Hey, guys. Race car driver Tyler Reddy. Hey, How's, How's it going? going? It's going good. Yeah. Glad you guys are here. Oh, yeah. We've been having so much fun today learning all about cars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh, We'd love to practice race car driving. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, do you think you could tell us a little bit more and maybe help us on the simulators? I absolutely can. We got three simulators here and uh, three things to keep in mind uh -huh. at Daytona. Don't lift off the gas. Okay. Be very smooth with the steering wheel. Uh -huh. And don't hit the brake. Whoa. Don't hit the brake. Yeah. Those are pretty, pretty good straightforward. Tips. Yeah. yeah. Whoa. So yeah, this is the steering wheel, and on this steering wheel here, you'll have the shifter to go up gears on this side, uh -huh. and this to go down gears on this side. Whoa. Under here, you got the gas pedal on the right, uh -huh. the brake is in the middle, and the clutch is on the left. The clutch is kind of helps the car get going. Oh, so, okay. Yep. How many gears are there? There are five gears. So as you go up through the gears, you'll end up in fifth gear. That's the gear you want to be in. Whoa, because we're going fast. Yes, very fast. <laughs> yeah. Well, that sounds pretty fun. Yeah. Do you think we could all race together? Let's do it. Yeah. Woo! Let's see what you got. Let's, let's have some fun. Yeah. Here yeah. we go. <gasps> Whoa. I can't believe we get to race an actual race car driver. Here we go. I'm going to win. Woo! <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. You guys on the racetrack going the right way? We are. I don't know. Yeah, I am definitely going the right way. I'm doing my best. Whoa. Whoa. I'm struggling over here. Whoa. But it's still fun. I think I'm right behind you, Tyler, but not sure. Who's going to I see you back there. I can imagine being out there with all those cars. Oh, so, so fast. <laughs> definitely be exciting. You guys are doing great. Thanks, Tyler. Aw, uh, thanks. Whoa. Whoa, Tyler, I don't want to beat you. All right, let's see what you got. <laughs> no, I'm going to win. Coming to the stripe. Here we go. This is exciting. I don't know who won. I can't tell. <laughs> yeah, it looks like I got 51242. Two. 51242. Two. I had a 51150, oh, but hey, that's really close. I think you're ready. What'd yeah. you get? Nothing. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Whoa. Well, Tyler won the race, but that makes sense because he's a professional. Well, thanks, Whoa, guys. I think awesome. you're ready to go. Me too, me too. You're ready to go. Yeah. That was fun. Well, hey, just yes. remember, got to have your safety equipment on before you get in the real thing. Oh, you got to yeah. have your helmet on right and have your seatbelt tight. But I think you guys are ready to go. Thanks, Tyler. Have fun. Thank That's you. Awesome. Let's go suit up. Yes. First things first. Safety, safety first. first. All right. See you later. Bye, guys. Yeah. Have fun. Whoa, Mika, look at this race car. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I can't wait to drive one. <laughs> okay, since I drove the simulator first, you can drive the race car first. Oh, Mika, thanks. <laughs> no oh. problem, bestie. Oh, that's really nice of you. And I am so excited to get out there on the track and speed around. <laughs> get in, okay. get in. Time to climb in. <laughs> Whoa, here we go. One leg and two leg. Woo. Watch your head. Whoa! <laughs> Ooh. And remember, you don't want to forget your seatbelt. Oh. Yay, go, Clippy! Woo! Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! Whoa, this is really fast. Check it out! Yeah! Here we go! <laughs> Oh, this is kind of bumpy. Look at how fast I'm going. Watch out, here comes Flippy. <laughs> Woo, yeah. Woohoo! Great job, Flippy. <laughs> Whoa, that was so much fun, Mika. Yay. Whoa. 
But now that I finished driving, it's your turn! Yes, Woo! it's my turn! Whoa! 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 That's fun! Okay. okay, time for me to get in! Whoa! There you go! Whoa! And while Mika's driving, I'm gonna be cheering her on! Woo! Okay. Here I go! See you at the finish line! Whoa! Come on. Oh, maybe we can come up with our very own cheer from Mika! Mika, Mika, Mika! Mika, 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 yeah! Go, Mika! Woo! Whoa, this is so cool! I can't believe I'm driving a real race car! Yeah! Vroom, vroom. Race car, Mika, coming down the track! She's right there! Mika! Woo! Yeah! Bye, Blippi! Bye, Blippi! <laughs> Was fast. <laughs> yeah! Woo! Yeah! <laughs> I can't believe how fast I'm going. Oh, whoa! This is so fast. <laughs> whoa! That's her. There you go. more of our videos, all you have to do is search for our name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with us? Okay, here we go. <laughs> Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. Flippy. Good <laughs> job. <laughs> Will you spell my name with us? <laughs> M-E-E-K-A-H. Mika. <laughs> okay, race ya. Mm. Okay, <laughs> you're on. Woo. It's me, Flippy! And today, we're here at Up Flying Yoga in Los Angeles, California! <laughs> Whoa! And check it out! We're so high up in the sky! <laughs> Look! You can see the mountains and trees, even buildings! <laughs> well, I am so excited because you and I get to have fun doing aerial arts! <laughs> yeah! Aerial means up in the air. <laughs> and we're gonna have lots of fun up in the air together. Come on. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. <laughs> I'm swinging in this hammock. <laughs> yeah, normally you might wanna take a nap in a hammock, but this one is great for swinging in, climbing on, and spinning. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, that's because this is an aerial hammock. Yeah, <laughs> you can do all kinds of things on it. Whoa, <laughs> it sure is fun. <laughs> oh, but if you're doing anything with aerial silks or aerial hammocks, you want to make sure there's a grown-up nearby so you stay nice and safe. <laughs> okay, let's swing. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Look at me go! <laughs> Whoa! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> yeah, you can swing sitting down or you can swing standing up. Woo! <laughs> Here we go. Woo! <laughs> Look at me go! <laughs> Whoa! I'm up so high! Hello! <laughs> Woo! I'm a bird! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> well, that's pretty silly. <laughs> but I think I want to spin some more. Here we go! Whoa! Check it out! It's an aerial cube! <laughs> Ooh, I bet we can climb up in this! Here we go! Whoa! 
Whoa, look. <laughs> oh, so relaxing in the cube. <laughs> yeah. Hey, do you know what a cube is? A cube is kind of like a square. Yeah, kind of like a square, but it's 3D. Whoa, and every side is the same size. Yeah, all six sides, whoa, are the same. <laughs> Check it out. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, <laughs> this is kind of tricky. Whoa, whoa, yeah, look. If you see it from this angle, it looks like a diamond. But I bet. Now, it kind of looks like a square. Woo. Yeah, a square. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Woo. Okay. <laughs> I should probably get down from here. Okay, here we go. Woo. <laughs> well, that was pretty fun, but I think I need a teacher to help me out a little bit. <laughs> it would probably make it a lot more fun and I could probably do some cool new things. <laughs> hmm. Let's go find someone to give us some tips. Whoa, check it out. It's an aerial instructor. <laughs> Whoa, she's really good at this. <laughs> oh, maybe she can teach us. <laughs> Let's go ask. <laughs> Hi, I'm Blippi. What's your name? Oh, hi, Blippi. <laughs> I'm Kimberly. Oh, it's nice to meet you, nice Kimberly. To meet you. <laughs> Whoa, you're really good at aerials. Thank you. Whoa. Ooh, well, we were doing some climbing and some spinning <laughs> and some swinging, but do you think you could help us? Uh, can you dance? Oh, I love to dance. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I love to dance. Perfect. Let's do some aerial dance then. Aerial dance? Oh, you mean we can dance, but in the air? That's exactly it. <laughs> I would love to. All okay. right, grab for your hammock. Okay, here we go. Whoa, <laughs> look at this hammock. So big and purple. <laughs> it's like a sail. Yeah, whoa. <laughs> whoa. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> okay, I have the hammock. Grab for one edge. Bring your thumbs inside. Okay. Fingers, all four of them on each hand. On the outside, slide your hands outside of your hips. Okay. Reach for six handfuls. One, two, three, four, five, Six. Perfect. Bring those elbows in, shoulders in. Ooh, okay. Press your fingertips towards the ground. Jump up inside. Whoa, <laughs> check it out. Ooh, we made it in the hammock. Hands up high towards the sky, all the way around the outside of the back. Grab it like a rope on each side. You can walk your legs forward so you're sitting on the very edge of this little ledge. Ooh, nice. And then slide your hands down so you've got it on both sides, just like you'd wear a belt. Ooh, here we go. <laughs> Good job. Yeah. All right, we're gonna go upside down. Are you ready? We get to go upside down? Yeah, I'm ready. You're gonna take your legs wide, keep your hands still, and then bring your feet together all the way around the front. Okay, here we go. Upside down, blippy. Woohoo! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! And then take your right foot and your left foot all the way around the outside of the purple fabric Ooh. to the front. Okay. Good job. Whoa! You look awesome. good. Yeah. <laughs> thumbs up. Thumbs up. Wait, thumbs down. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Okay. You want to go for a spin? Yeah. Let's do it. Time to spin. <laughs> Don't want to get too dizzy. <laughs> oh, so what should we do next? You want to do a handstand? Yeah. All right. Your fingers come on the floor, directly under your shoulders. Tuck your chin to your chest. Look at those toes. Flex your feet. Straighten out your legs. Now straighten out your hands. Whoa. Feet towards the sky even more. Handstand. Yeah. Check it out. Whoa, that was fun. You want to do a no-hand handstand? A no-hand handstand? Sure. All right. Straighten out the legs. Straighten out the arms. Okay. Hands off. Whoa, check it out. No hands. How stretchy are you? Can you reach to your toes? Reach for those toes. Yeah. Bend your knees. Whew. And lift up. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, we're up so high. But I do have one question. Kimberly, how do we get down? Oh, well, that's even more fun. You're gonna reach for both hands on one fabric. Okay. All right, keep that left knee bent, reach the right toes towards the floor, come forward. Yes. And slide those hands down, bend your right knee, grab a hold of your right hand with the right foot. Ta-da! Ta-da! Pigeon drop. 
Whoa! This is awesome! <laughs> Whoa! Check it out! Look at these! <laughs> Whoa! They kind of look like a hammock, but there's not a place to sit. What are these called? This is called an aerial silk. It's like a hammock upside down. Whoa! An upside down hammock? <laughs> That's fun. Well, how do we play with these? You want to try to climb it? Yeah, that would be great. Okay. You're going to grab a hold of it. Okay. Yep. <laughs> and I want you to kind of hug the fabric with your legs so your right leg comes up. Okay. Turn around, give it a giant hug, and flex the foot. Okay. You're going to slide the fabric underneath the toes. Oh, okay. And then you're going to reach your other foot onto the fabric and kind of hook it like you're crisscrossing. Great. So I pull Crisscross on the fabric. Crisscross one toe to the other. Yep. Like that. Awesome. It gets easier if you use both hammocks, or uh, both silks. Do you want to try it together? Yeah! Okay, we'll try both silks. See if I can climb to the top. Okay. Okay. So. Bring them together, give it like a giant little bear hug, your uh, leg. <laughs> okay, now we take our leg around. That's right. Like this. Yep. Flex our foot. Bring it as high as you can. Even higher. Woo. Even higher. Woo. Good job. And then, up we go! <laughs> Woo! You can go higher. Okay. Whoa! Look how high I am! All the way to the top, Lippy. Good job! Whoa! I made it to the top! Whoa! Look at how high we are! Everything looks amazing from up here. Okay, I think it's time to come down. Nice and slowly. You're going to squeeze your legs together and walk your hands down. Work with your legs, not with your hands. Whoa! Here I go! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> we made it! Good job! Yeah. Nice landing. Whoa! That was amazing! Whoa! You've taught us so many amazing dance moves and how to climb a silk. <laughs> Thank you so much for teaching us today, Kimberly. You're welcome. Uh, well, I'll see you soon. I think I have all these tools. Now I can do my very own aerial blippy dance. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> it's time for some blippy dancing. <laughs> yeah. Kimberly was so helpful and taught us all kinds of dance moves. And now we can take those dance moves and make blippy choreography. Oh, that's kind of a big word. Choreography. <laughs> Have you heard that word before? Well, it's just a big fancy word for lots of dance moves put together. <laughs> we can do that. Time to dance! a great day with you today, learning all about aerial arts. <laughs> and we even got to dance to our very own aerial blippy dance. Woohoo! <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> great. OK, here we go. B-L-I. P-P-I, -I. Blippi, good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Woo! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. Hi, and I'm Mika. And look at where we're at today. Today, we're at Explore It Science Center. Yeah, that's right, in Davis, California. Yeah, and this place is awesome because today we're going to learn about science. Yeah, and we get to explore our environment. The plants, the animals. Ooh, the air and some water. Oh, the sun. Whoa, <laughs> this is going to be fun. Yeah, come on. <laughs> wow. Oh, so colorful. <laughs> yeah, look at all these flags. Whoa, I have an idea. Will you say the colors with us? <laughs> cool. <laughs> Green, Green, yellow, yellow orange, orange, red, purple. purple. Oh, nice. <laughs> Hey, will you count the flags with us? Okay. Cool. <laughs> One, two, three, 
four, five. Whoa, five flags. Good job. <laughs> oh, hey. Hi. Hi, welcome to Explore It Science Center. Oh, thank Whoa. you. I'm Blippi. Hi, I'm Mika. My name's David. I teach people about science. Oh, we love science. <laughs> yeah, what are we going to learn today? I have two clues for each of you to tell you what you're going to learn about today. Wow, thank you. Yeah, cool. Yeah, so we get a guess? Yes, you do. Well, I need to get back to work. Let me know if you need anything. Okay, All right, thank you. See ya. Oh, wow, this is wow, fun. Oh, yeah, let's see. Oh, okay, my first clue is, on a beautiful day, we enjoy the sun and windy breeze. Learn how they both generate power with ease. Huh. Oh. I wonder if it's, Wind or solar energy. Oh, yeah, you're on the right track, Mika. Yeah. <laughs> What's your say? Okay, it says, they're cold-blooded and like warm weather. <laughs> Find some reptiles hanging out together. Huh. Reptiles. Maybe it's reptiles. Maybe snakes or Ooh. lizards or toidles. <laughs> <laughs> Turtles. <laughs> oh. Well, kind of sounds different, right? Yeah, so maybe I'll look for mine over there. Okay, I'll go over here. All right, see, see you. See you soon, good luck. Whoa, this is it. This is a wind station. Did you know that wind can generate electricity? It can help heat up homes, turn on the lights, and this is a wind turbine. It takes wind and turns it into energy. Okay, let's see how this will work. See a fan here, let's turn it on. See? Oh, it's spinning kind of fast. I wonder what will happen if I turn up the speed. Oh, now it's really fast. That's a lot of energy. Hey, there's more back here. Maybe if I take another one. Oh, I'll choose purple, one of my favorite colors. <laughs> okay, put this here. Hmm. Now we have two. See what happens. Come on, you can do it. <laughs> there we go. Wow, double the power, double the energy. <laughs> awesome. Wow, power of the wind. Oh, come over here. This is a solar power unit. Did you know that we can get power from the sun? So the sun hits the solar panel and then it can turn on. That's from the power of the sun. Isn't that so cool? <gasps> Whoa, there's a really big solar panel outside. Let's go check it out. Whoa, cool. Looks like two reptile enclosures. Hmm, I don't see anything in here. Huh, I wonder where they are. Oh, hey David. Whoa, who's this? This is Lizard. She's a type of lizard called a blue tongue skink. Whoa, Blizzard the Lizard. Whoa, and she's a skink? Yes, she is. Whoa. Whoa, what a cool looking lizard. Whoa, and why is she sticking out her tongue? She uses her tongue to help herself smell. Whoa, you and I, we smell with our noses. But yeah, lizards use their tongues. Uh, <laughs> whoa, and how old is she? She just turned 18 years old. Whoa, that's really old for a lizard. Whoa, and she's really cool colored, like brown and tan, why is that? Those colors help her hide, it's called camouflage. Ooh, camouflage? Whoa, yeah, maybe like a tiger or a chameleon or a zebra? Whoa, ooh, and are those holes on the side of her head, ears? They are, that's how she hears. Whoa, hello, Blizzard. <laughs> nice to meet you, I'm Blippi. <laughs> Whoa, do you mind if I touch her? If you're very careful and use two fingers, touch her right over here. Okay. Whoa. Oh, you are so cute. Wow, nice to meet you. Wow, do you have any other friends I can meet? 
Sure, let me go get one. All right. Wow, this is so cool. That was really cool being able to touch her. Whoa, it's so soft and scaly. Wow, definitely we're meeting some reptiles. Whoa, check it out, a snake. Who's this? This is Lizzie. Oh, hey Lizzie. Wow, is she venomous or poisonous or anything? Should I worry? No, she's not dangerous to people. Okay, <laughs> cool. Wow, and why is she black with white stripes? Is that also camouflage? Yes, it is. Whoa, and she's also sticking out her tongue. Is she smelling? Yep. Whoa, how do I smell? <laughs> pretty good. Whoa, she looks pretty long and she looks nice and relaxed with you. Whoa, that was so much fun meeting your reptile friends. Thank you so much. You're welcome. All right, well, I should probably get back to seeing what Mika's learning. All right, see you later, David. See ya. <laughs> Check it out, a really big solar panel. That one is called a flat plate collector and it collects the sunlight and turns it into a lot of energy. Way more energy than the little solar panel we saw inside. <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> hey, Mika. Oh, hey, Flippy. Oh, what'd you find? Well, I found a wind turbine, a solar panel, and check out this really big one behind us. Wow, that's huge. Yeah, what did you find? Well, I saw some reptiles. Oh. I saw a lizard. <gasps> yeah, I gotta even touch it. No way. Yeah. And there's even a snake. Whoa. Yeah, they smell with their tongues. <laughs> <laughs> that's really cool. Yeah. Hey, we do have another clue. Oh, mine's yellow too. I wonder if it's the same. Let's see. Oh yeah, they are. Do you want to read it together? Yeah. Okay, ready? Follow the trail to the yellow flowers to learn which animals have pollinating power. Oh, I wonder. Yeah, do you see a trail anywhere? <gasps> right over there. Let's go. <laughs> Whoa, check it out. Butterflies. Yeah, butterflies are so cool and they're pollinators. Yeah. <laughs> Pollination is when one of these butterflies maybe drinks some nectar from one flower and gets some pollen all over its body. Yeah, and then it flies over to a next flower and some of that pollen sprinkles off its body onto that flower. Wow, pollination. Yeah. Wow, what's over here? Ooh. Whoa. Bats. bats! Oh, I see butterflies still. Yeah! Those bats are so cool. They're black and they love to come out at night. Yeah, and they're also pollinators. Yeah, they like to eat parts of the flower or maybe they drink some nectar. That's true. And all of this helps the flowers make seeds. Very useful and practical animals. Yes, yeah, let's see what else we have over here. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, cool. Hummingbirds. Yeah. Ooh, look at them flapping their wings so fast. So, so fast. Whoa. <laughs> look right here, Mika. Oh. Wow. Bees. bees. Honey bees. Look. Oh, they're Blippi. just. What? Those are yellow flowers. Oh, yeah, they are. That's on our clue. Yeah, yellow flowers. Oh. Do you see any? <gasps> There's more over there. Where? Oh. Come on. Let's go. <laughs> Come on. Whoa, here they are. Yeah, the yellow flowers. Wow, one of your two favorite colors. Ooh, that's right. You really like them? Yeah, they're so pretty. Yeah, <laughs> look at all of this stuff. Oh, what do we have here? Whoa, looks like some big white gloves. Whoa. Hey. That will protect your hands when you're dealing with bees. Yeah, and this is what? beekeeper stuff. Yeah, you want to try right. that on? Yeah, thanks. Whoa, look at this. Oh, hello. Whoa. Yeah, and see this? Yeah, you wear this on your head. Mm -hmm. Ooh, and this covers your face and your body. Yeah. yeah. So then you don't get stung while handling the bees nice and carefully. So smart. Whoa. Oh, we also have this. Oh, a smoker. Whoa. That calms the bees down and lets them know to go back into their hive yep. while you're working. Yeah. yeah. Look at this. Yeah, these are the honeycombs, right? Yep. And that brush will safely get the bees to leave the honeycomb so that the beekeepers can work with the honeycomb. Yeah, and then the beekeepers yeah, can chop off all the wax. Yeah, because the bees cap it with wax, 
And on the inside, that's where the honey is. Yeah, ooh, so yummy. Yum. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna set this down right here. Uh, the lippy. Yeah. It looks like we have some fun things here. Whoa. <laughs> Check it out. Puppets. Yeah, they're Whoa. like little finger puppets. Yeah. Look, Whoa. I have a monarch butterfly. Oh, so colorful. Oh, oh, it really likes this flower right here. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, look, the butterfly is pollinating. Whoa. Wow, good job, monarch. Ooh, <laughs> look at me. I'm a honeybee. Whoa. Whoa. Hello, honeybee. Hello. Oh, do you like these yellow flowers? Oh, so tasty. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> what else do we have here? Whoa. A hummingbird? Whoa. <laughs> yeah, they can flap their wings so fast. Yeah. Yum. Good job pollinating, hummingbird. <laughs> so much nectar. Hey, look, I have a bee too. Oh, hello, bee. Oh, hello. How are you? I'm okay. I'm just looking for some beautiful yellow flowers. Oh, follow me. I'll show you. Okay. <laughs> Whoa. 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 Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was a really fun day. Yeah, we learned so much together. Yeah, we had so much science fun. Whoa, yeah. Like how I got to meet those reptiles. Whoa, and how do they smell like <laughs> With their tongues. <laughs> so funny. Yeah. And I learned about solar energy and the power of the wind Whoa. and how it can regulate electricity. <laughs> oh, that's really cool. Yeah. And it was really cool seeing those pollinators. Oh, yeah, that was super fun. And the puppet show. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Well, if you love my videos and want to watch more, all you have to do is search for my name. Will you spell my name with us? <laughs> all right. <laughs> B L I P P I. Flippy, good job. <laughs> hey, will you spell my name with us? Cool. <laughs> M E E K A H. Mika. Mika. <laughs> All right, see you again. Bye bye. See you later. It's me, Blippi. <laughs> and today, we're here at Angel Stadium in Anaheim, California. <laughs> and today, we get to go to Monster Jam. <laughs> yeah. Monster Jam is an event with monster trucks. <laughs> yeah. Do you know what a monster truck is? You do? Have you seen one before? <laughs> they are enormous. They are gigantic. <laughs> well, I'm really excited to see a monster truck. Oh, and maybe we can even meet the driver. <laughs> this is going to be so cool seeing them race and jump off ramps and maybe even do a flip. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> I can't wait to see a Monster Jam monster truck up close. <laughs> I've been driving around in my Flippy Mobile all day trying to find one. Hmm. Do you see a monster truck anywhere around here? Hmm. <laughs> Whoa! Check it out! It's a monster truck! <laughs> Whoa! It's so big! <laughs> no way! And look at who it is! Hey, what's up, Flippy? <laughs> It's professional Monster Jam driver, Barry Musauer! <laughs> Whoa, it's What's so good up? to see you! <laughs> it's great to be here, man. Whoa, and look at this! This monster truck is huge! <laughs> is this a Monster Jam monster truck? This is. This is Grave Digger, but this is a special Grave Digger because it actually can take passengers for a ride in a real Monster Jam truck. <laughs> Whoa, no way! Did you hear that? You can go for a ride in this monster truck! <gasps> that sounds so fun! <laughs> Oh, and Bari, is this your monster truck? No, my monster truck's actually inside. It's called Zombie, and it's got zombie arms on it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> so silly. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> can we take a closer look at your monster truck? Yeah, let's take a look at it. Let's go inside. <laughs> okay, let's go inside. Oh, wait a minute. We can go there on the Blippi Mobile. <laughs> would you like to take a ride with me? I would love to go in the Blippi Mobile. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> Check it out! 
It's zombie. <laughs> awesome. Can we take a closer look? Yeah, come on, check it out. Whoa. What's your favorite thing about driving in a monster truck? Oh, aside from meeting all the great Monster Jam fans, I love doing donuts. Ooh, a donut? Is that when you drive around in a circle? Whoa. Yep, and I also <laughs> like to eat donuts too. Oh, I like to eat donuts too. <laughs> They're so yummy. Do you like to eat donuts too? Yum! <laughs> Whoa! And this thing is so big! Yeah. Whoa, check it out! These wheels, they're enormous! These tires are 66 inches tall, and they are 43 inches wide, and they weigh 650 pounds! 650 <laughs> pounds? Oh! Yeah! Whoa, those are so big, so tall, and so heavy! Whoa, and what's this? This is the engine. This is a 540 cubic inch Merlin racing engine, and it runs on methanol for fuel, and man, is it powerful. Whoa, methanol? Hmm, so it doesn't use gasoline? Nope, methanol, it burns clean, and it gives us a whole lot of horsepower. Whoa, that's a lot of horsepower, and a lot of horses. <laughs> Whoa, well, what are these right here? Those are the shocks. You want to come check those out? Get a closer look. <laughs> okay, let's go take a closer look at the shocks. All okay, right. I'll see you around the back. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Look at how tall Zombie is! Whoa! <laughs> it's taller than us! <laughs> Ooh, and these right here, are those the shocks? These are the shocks. They have 30 inches of travel in the back, 26 inches of travel in the front. That's how we absorb those huge, big air jumps. <laughs> Whoa! Did you hear that? Yeah! A truck like this has shocks. So, if it takes a really big jump, <laughs> you can land nice and safely. <laughs> Whoa, and what's this right here? This is the wheelie bar, man. This is for when I'm doing those really cool slap wheelies and I get to drag this thing in the dirt and it keeps me from tipping over. <laughs> well, that's really important. You don't want to tip over your Monster Jam truck. <laughs> Whoa, and this box, is that where the fuel goes? That is where the fuel goes. Well, this is a pretty cool truck. You think you could show us how to drive it? Yeah, let me show you how to get in. Okay, <laughs> come on. <laughs> Whoa, I'm so excited because you and I get to go in the Monster Jam truck. <laughs> yeah, but first I ask permission from Bart. That's why I can climb up. And second, I'm not gonna drive it. Uh-oh, <laughs> cause I'm not a professional. Yeah, and I'm gonna be nice and safe. Okay, time to climb up into zombie. <laughs> Here we go! Whoa! Check it out! <laughs> Zombie! Oh! <laughs> Hello! Whoa! I'm so high up! <laughs> this is awesome! Whoa! It must be really fun driving a Monster Jam truck! <laughs> Whoa! This is pretty amazing! <laughs> Will you do some zombie arms with us? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Okay. Whoa! <laughs> 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 has gonna ride zombie. <laughs> Whoa! Hi, Barry. Hey, Blippi, what's up, man? Whoa! What are you wearing? Man, this is my racing suit. Mine's decorated in zombie. Whoa! That is so cool. You see it? Yeah. He has a zombie racing suit, but. Why do you need to wear a racing suit? Well, you have to be safe. When it's time to race these trucks, safety is number one. Mm. And look, huh. I got you your very own jacket too. <gasps> no way, <laughs> check it out. <laughs> Let's put them on. Whoa, it's an official Monster Jam racing jacket. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> Here we go. This makes you really official, man. Whoa. Zip that thing right up. <laughs> this is awesome. Whoa. Check it out! It even has a zipper! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Perfect! Yeah! <laughs> this is cool! You're gonna be safe just like me! Awesome! Well, you get in the truck, and we're gonna watch you someplace really safe! <laughs> okay, all right, I'll get in. But wait, there's one more thing that I gotta have you wear to make sure you're really super safe, okay? <gasps> Check this out. <gasps> Your very own Monster Jam Blippy helmet! <laughs> wow! Check it out! It's a Monster Jam Blippy helmet. <gasps> this is the best day ever. <laughs> Woo! This is awesome. <laughs> okay, I'll see you soon. All right, bud. <laughs> Woo! See ya. Whoa! Check it out! 
were all ready to drive. Bar is in the truck. I have my blippy helmet. <laughs> and we're ready to race. <laughs> See you soon. You hear that? The engine is so loud! <laughs> Blippi, let's Whoa. see what the Blippi Mobile's got. Whoa. Check it out. Oh yeah, let's Whoa. see. <laughs> Woo. Woo. Thanks for coming out, Blippi. That was so much fun to show you, Zombie. Thanks for showing me the Blippi Mobile. Well, you're welcome. Yeah, it was a blast learning so much from you all about Monster Jam, and it was really nice learning from a great driver. <laughs> I can't wait to do it all over again. But before you go, take your helmet with you. Whoa, okay. <laughs> you don't want to forget this. <laughs> Thanks, Barry. I'll see you soon. All right, dude. See ya. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs> Whoa, that was awesome.
awesome being here today at Monster Jam. We saw some pretty cool trucks that were so big and so loud. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, can you spell my name with me? <laughs> okay, here we go. B-L-I-P. P-P-I, Flippy. Good job. <laughs> well, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>
the big off-road tires. Yeah. All right, here we go. Oh, <laughs> it's gonna get messy. All right, there we go. Ooh, cool. <laughs> there we go. Good job, those are some big tires. <laughs> All right, let's see, what do we have here? Oh, yeah. Musical instruments. <laughs> Just kidding, yeah, spray paint. All right, hey, before I use any spray paint, I'm gonna wear a respirator. Yeah, a mask. All right, here we go, yeah. And only adults should use spray paint. Okay, here we go. Let's start with the orange. Here we go. Let's see, what part is orange? Looks like a little bit of the chairs are orange. Yeah, and the two stripes. Okay, here we go. There we go, there's my chair. <laughs> All right, and then that stripe and that stripe. Whoa, this is looking really good. Okay, all we need now, oh, wait a second. Yeah, you're right. The wheels are also orange. <laughs> Can't put the orange away now. Wow, this is looking really great. Good job. Okay, let's put this one away. All right, and now for some blue. All right, let's see, what's blue on it? Well, the rest of it's blue. I'm not gonna color this though. Yeah, because that is the windshield. All right, I'll start with the bottom right down here. Just a little bit left. Whoa! Wow! <laughs> Whoa! We did such a great job! The Blippi Mobile looks amazing! I sure do love crafts and art! Woohoo! <laughs> Look at this house. Whoa, it's really white. And you know what it looks like? It looks like the White House. Yeah, the White House is where the President of the United States lives. Whoa, what a cool looking house. I sure do love exploring with you. Shall we keep exploring? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Woohoo! Whoa, check it out. Yeah, the party station. Wow, this store is a place where you can buy party supplies. Yeah, like balloons. Whoa, streamers. <laughs> Confetti. Whoa, you also might be able to get a cake in there. Yum, I love cake. And party invitations. So you can invite all your friends. Yeah, cool store. All right, here we go. What else do we have around here? Oh, look! Yeah! <laughs> we know what this place is. Yeah, it says Adventure City. Yeah, I've been there before. That is a very fun amusement park in California. Yeah, they have some roller coasters, slides, yeah, and even some games. Woohoo! <laughs> here we go! Wow, hasn't this been 
having so much fun exploring with the Blippi Mobile? Yeah! It sure has been. Me, me, me. Do you see that? Whoa! It looks like a train! Why don't we park the Blippi Mobile right here? Yeah, come back later. But in the meantime, take a ride on a train! Yeah! <laughs> I sure do love trains. Wow, it was great being able to sightsee. Oh yeah, speaking of sightseeing, yeah, the Blippi Mobile. Let me hop back in so then we can keep exploring. <laughs> Gotta buckle up. <laughs> All right, here we go. Woohoo! <laughs> What are these? Yeah, I know what these are. These are safety cones. Whoa, and I love the color. Orange, whoa, one of my two favorite colors. Whoa, safety cones are used, yeah, to place on the ground, like that, to let people know that there's something around here. Yeah, just so you don't hit it. Or you could also place a few of them. <laughs> yeah, like that. And then you can make an obstacle course. Check it out. Yeah, you can weave between them. Hey, I have an idea. Yeah, why don't we place all of these cones out in a straight line and weave with the Blippi Mobile between them. Yeah, hey, let's count them first. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six cones. All right, let's gather them up. Yeah. All right, let's place the first cone right here. Oh, I have an idea. Will you count them with me? <laughs> One, two, <laughs> three, four. Six! Six cones! Good job counting with me! All right, first, you need to buckle up. All right, here we go. Ready? Three, two, one! Whoa! We got some of them, but we didn't get all of them. Hey, I have an idea. Why don't we head back to the starting line and then space them out a little bit more and maybe that will help. Let's try it again. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs>
Let's try this again. Three, two, one, go! awesome? Yeah! I sure did have a lot of fun learning with you today. Yeah, wasn't it fun going through that obstacle course, swerving between those cones? Yeah, and exploring and learning about the Blippi Mobile! Wow! <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name! Will you spell my name with me? <laughs> B L I P P I Flippy. Good job. See you soon. Bye bye. Hello. Hey, it's me, Flippy. And look at where we're at. Whoa. Yeah, today we're at Moonlight Rollerway in Glendale, California. Woohoo! This is a place where you can roller skate. Woohoo! Yeah. Have you ever roller skated before? It is so much fun. But first, I have someone really important and special to introduce you to. It's Mika, and she is my best friend. Hey, Blippi. Whoa! Hi, everyone. I'm Mika. Yeah! Mika is my best friend. Oh, Blippi, you're my best friend. Oh, Mika, <laughs> you're my best friend. <laughs> hey, Mika, do you want to know what we're going to do today? Yeah. Check it out. Moonlight Roller Wave? Really good balance. Yeah, you do. I bet you are gonna do really good. Oh, we'll see. I bet you're gonna do really good. <laughs> All right, let's go. Yeah, come on. between ice skates and roller skates? Yeah, an ice skate has a blade, and roller skates have four wheels, two in the front and two in the back. <laughs> yeah, you're right, Mika. Yeah. Hey, should we go get on our roller skates? Yes, I can't wait. Yeah. Whoa, look at all these skates. Oh, there's so many. Hello. Hi. Hey, who are you? I'm Pedro. Oh, hi, I'm Mika. And I'm Blippi. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. What are you up to? I'm disinfecting these skates. Whoa, oh. disinfecting? Ooh, can I see? Yes, you can. Whoa, check it out. Disinfectant. Whoa, <laughs> that way it can get all of the germs out of the skates and keep them nice and clean. Yeah, so then they're not really stinky. Oh. Ew, <laughs> ew. <laughs> Here you go, Pedro. Oh. So you really want to go roller skating? What's the first thing we should do? We first need to figure out what size skate you wear. Oh! Do you know your shoe size? Whoa! If you know your shoe size, that's your roller skate size. <laughs> yeah! Hey, do you have big sizes and small sizes? Or what size do you have? We have from toddler sizes. Oh, so cute! Whoa! <laughs> very big sizes. Whoa! Whoa, check it out! 
This one's so small. Yeah, and this one's really big. Wow, <laughs> so cool. What's the largest size you have, Pedro? This is the largest one at a 16. Whoa. Whoa. Up to 16, that's a lot of sizes. Yeah, <laughs> will you count to 16 with us? Awesome. Yeah. One, two, two three, three, four, five, six, six seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16! Yeah! Whoa! Ooh. I got these for you, Mika. Thank you! And these are for you, Blizzard. Ooh, thank you so much, Pedro! Yeah! Whoa! Shall we go put on our roller skates? Yes, I can't wait! Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Parts on the skate. Yeah, oh look. The wheel. Whoa, let's count them together. Okay. One, two, two three, four. four. Wow. Four wheels. So cool. And what's this up front? Oh, this is the toe stop. It helps you break so you can stop. Wow, cool. Oh, and check this out. Yeah, it looks like we have some brown shoelaces. So then you can tighten it up around your foot so your foot doesn't fall out. Yep, yeah, nice. Whoa! And look, it kind of looks like a shoe, but it's not called a shoe. Yeah! It's called a boot! Yeah! <laughs> Woo! But before we go out and skate, we should probably get on our safety gear! Yeah, safety gear! Okay, what do you have, Oh, let's see. We have... Oh, a book! I have too. You do? Yep! Yeah! Wrist guards! Yeah, you put them on your wrists, so then it keeps your hands nice and safe! Yeah! Oh! Ooh. What do you have? We also have some elbow pads. Wow. Yep, they go right here on your elbow. All of these things will protect you in case you fall down. Yeah. Ooh, and these kind of look like elbow pads, but they're bigger. Yeah. These are actually for your knees. Yep. So then your knees are nice and protected. Whoa. <laughs> Ooh. And last but not least, helmets. Yeah. Mine's the color blue. That's one of my two favorite colors. Yeah. <laughs> and I have all sorts of colors on here. Blue, pink, and orange. Your other favorite color. Oh, Mika, you're so silly. <laughs> well, shall we gear up so then we can roller skate? Yes, I can't wait. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's go. Whoa, now we have our skates and our helmets on. We should probably put on our... Wow. Thanks, Flippy. <laughs> You're welcome. Wow. 
This is really hard, huh? Yeah, it's pretty tricky trying to keep your balance up here. Yeah, it is. Whoa. Whoa. Do you see that? Wow. Whoa. That's really good. Yeah. Whoa. Hi, guys. How are you? Pretty Hi. good. How are you? What's I'm your name? I'm doing really well. My, I'm Coach JC here with Moonlight Rollerway. And I would like to teach both of you to skate better. Wow. wow. You're a coach. That means you must know a lot about roller skating. Just yeah. a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> but let's get started. What I'd like to do is teach you first, see how you're losing your balance. Yeah. We want to get you both in the T position. So you're going to roll your skate behind, put it in a T, and look, you can stand up nice and tall Whoa. and hold your balance. So yeah, see? Yeah. And I noticed that you were just falled. And so let's see if we can go over that. Let's okay. go over okay. practice falling and getting back up. Wait, okay. we're gonna practice falling? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> awesome, so let's all sit down. Okay. We're gonna get down just like this. Okay. And the Whoa. first thing you always wanna do when you're on the ground is get your hands off the floor okay. so that no one can roll over them. Oh. So hands in the lap, and okay. then we're gonna roll over on two knees. Okay. So we're gonna go two knees down, and then we're gonna go one knee up. We're gonna take both hands, put it on that knee, and we're gonna look up because we're going up. We're gonna push straight up, and look, we're gonna go right back into that T. We Whoa. just practiced. Wow! Now, Mika, you can get up on your own if you fall again. Yeah, wow, thanks for teaching us that. No yeah. problem, that's great. So now, can you guys both say one, two, three, roll? Yeah. yeah. One, two, two three, three, roll. roll. Awesome, that means you can skate. Okay, what? so we're gonna put action to all those words you just said. Okay. So we're gonna now take our T and move it into a letter V. Letter and v. by putting a letter V with your skates, see how we can touch the back wheels? Yeah. Yep. We're gonna put our hands in front, we're gonna keep our knees bent, and we're gonna keep our hands nice and straight and our heads up. And we're gonna go one, two, three, roll. Okay, okay let's do that together. All right, ready? Yep. One, two, three, roll! Whoa. See? And if you lose control, what's the letter we go right back to? The T. Oh. The letter? The T. Whoa. That's going to be your favorite letter today. Yeah. Okay, so from the T, we're going to go back to the B, and we're going to try rolling just a little bit further this time. All right. Yay. Ready? One, one two, two, three, three. Roll! And we're gonna keep going, and this time, we're gonna try and put our heel back, okay. and lift and get that toe stop into the surface. Oh, whoa! That See? was cool! We just stopped with the toe stop. We really just stopped. Toe stop, and now watch, to the T. To the T. Our favorite letter. And yeah. then we're gonna go right across, and we're gonna keep going with our marching and our hands strong in front. Whoa. One, two, three. One, two, three. three. Roll! Whoa. Wow, look how good your both are getting. Whoa. I'm we so excited. Getting, yeah, we are getting really good, huh, yeah, Mika? I feel much better about skating now. Whoa! Great job, you guys, and you're skating safely. Yeah! Whoa, look well, at us. shall we show us your stuff now? Yes. Yeah. You guys go on, enjoy your skate. All right. Thank you. Nice job. Whoa! 
That was awesome! That was so fun! Yeah! Hey Pedro, thanks for hooking us up with these awesome roller skates! Yeah! No problem. <laughs> yeah, it was really fun and Nika did really good! Her balance is great! Aw, thanks Blippi! You did really great too! What a fun day! <laughs> Glad you guys had a good time. Yeah. Thanks. See you later, Pedro. Wow, that was so much fun. We learned so many cool things today and really got to practice our balance and skating skills. Yeah, we did. Well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Mm -hmm. Will you spell my name with me? Yeah. Oh, yeah. B L I P P I. Blippi. Good job. Wait. How do you spell your name? Oh, I'll tell you. It's M-E-E-K-A-H. Wow. <laughs> wow, Mika. Hey, why don't we go on some more fun field trips together soon? Yes, I would love to, Flippy. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> All right, see ya. Bye-bye. <laughs>
Woo! Exactly, exactly. Okay, well, I think we're ready to start the experiment. What's the first step? Okay, so first, you're going to want to put your baking soda in the paint can. Just pour it all in. Okay, here, can you help me? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> here we go! Woohoo! It's snowing! <laughs> snowing in the paint can. Whoa! Oh, <laughs> it's a little messy doing oh, yeah. science experiments. <laughs> okay, now you want to put your vinegar in this cup very carefully. Oh, and then we put the cup inside. Exactly. Mm, okay, yes. Here we go. Don't want to spill any on the baking soda before it goes in. <laughs> yes, be very careful. We don't want to kickstart the acid-base chemical reaction too soon. So just softly nestle it into the baking soda, just like that, exactly, exactly. Whoa. <laughs> yes. Looks pretty steady. Perfect. Now for the fun part. Okay. <laughs> we're going to hammer on the lid. Oh, that's why you were hammering before. <laughs> exactly. Okay, here we go. Is this okay? Yep, perfect. And Emily, you want to hammer some? Absolutely. You need to put a little bit of oomph behind Whoa. it. Whoa! That's some oomph! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think it's ready. Yeah! Okay, and now we just flip it over. Exactly. Okay, everyone, take 10 steps back! <laughs> Here we go! Three, two, one! <laughs> Did you see that? Yeah! Flippy, do you want to see what was going on inside the paint can? Oh, that would be awesome! <laughs> yeah, we saw it launch like a rocket, but I want to see those carbon dioxide bubbles. <laughs> okay, okay, so what do we need to do? We can make them right here. So we have vinegar, that's our acid, and we have baking soda, that's our base. Mm. So what we're gonna do is add our food coloring first because everything is more fun in color. Whoa! We'll you blue. And you have orange! I have orange. <laughs> yeah, huh, I wonder why we're using those two colors. <laughs> <laughs> I thought they might be your favorite. Yeah. So go ahead and add a few drops, just like that, and Whoa. let's stir it in. Hey. Give it a good stir. Now in one of these, I'm going to add some soap. My hypothesis is that the soap is going to trap those carbon dioxide bubbles and make this one a bit more frothy and soapy. Whoa! Hey, have you heard the word hypothesis before? Yeah, it's a really long word for basically a guess. <laughs> and Emily, I think you made a really good guess. <laughs> I think so. Let's test it out, though. OK. OK, here we go. <laughs> Ready? Three, two, one! Whoa! 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 Check it out! Look, do you see how mine looks a little bit more frothy? Whoa. That's the soap trapping those carbon dioxide bubbles. Yeah, it looks like yours has a lot of teeny bubbles, and I have really big bubbles! Exactly. <laughs> Whoa, that's cool. And Emily, we used this experiment using cups. Mm -hmm. Could we use a different container? Absolutely, we could. Oh, what about that water bottle? This could be <laughs> Perfect. Huh. I wonder how the bubbles will shoot out of that. <laughs> I know. My hypothesis is, is because this one is going from a large area to a small area, it's going to shoot up faster and maybe go a little higher. Hmm. Another good guess. It. We got to <laughs> test it. Oh, and what color should we make this? Well, my favorite color is pink. Ooh. Can we make it pink? Yeah, let's make it pink. <laughs> okay. One, oh. two, three. There we go. Stir that in. Whoa. It's like a pinky red color. Oh, yeah. Oh. That's going to be some fun bubbles. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to pour it in and let's see what happens. <laughs> let's test that hypothesis. Okay, get ready. These are going to be some big bubbles. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Your it hypothesis did. was right. It shot up higher, didn't yeah. it? That was great. Whoa, that was really cool. Bubble launch. Woo! Now it looks so pink. Look at that. Whoa. Yeah, we have some pink, and we have some orange, and some blue. Woo, look, Emily, we have a fun little elephant in some blue water just taking a bubble bath. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait a minute. We tried a cup and a water bottle. What if we try something a little bit silly? Okay, <laughs> what did you have in mind? An orange! <laughs> Let's try it. Yeah, I love the color orange, and I love eating the fruit and orange. <laughs> okay, so we have an orange, Ooh, and there's some baking soda inside, and here's some vinegar for okay, you. Okay, thank you. And this one, 
I want to be extra silly, so let's make the vinegar green. Oh, I like it. We haven't done green yet. Whoa! Perfect. <laughs> I'm going to stir that up. All right, let's see what this one looks like. Okay. I don't I'm, know what it's going to look like. I'm going to try to hold it. My hypothesis is that this is going to be messy. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Go! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! It's so busy! <laughs> Whoa, Emily, that was awesome! Uh, that was great! Whoa, yeah. Look at that. So many bubbles. There's carbon dioxide bubbles went everywhere. That's a great acid-base chemical reaction mm -hmm. right there. <laughs> well, this was some fun experimenting. Mm -hmm. Do you think we could do another one? I think so. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go clean up my hand. <laughs> Flippy, are you ready for the next experiment? Mm -hmm. I'm really excited, but I think we should take a little break first. And look, a swing set! <laughs> Let's on. go! Woo! <laughs> Whoa, I just love swinging. <laughs> uh, but Emily, yeah. is there something scientific about swinging? Oh my gosh, yes, there's science all around us. With Whoa. swings, gravity is bringing us back down, and our legs are giving us momentum to bring Ooh. us back up. <laughs> yeah, and my legs are really strong from dancing, so I can go really high on the swing! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Whoa, good thing we have gravity to bring me back down, <laughs> or else I might fly all the way to the moon. Woo, <laughs> that would be fun. <laughs> Whoa, yeah. <laughs> Astronaut Flippy, here I come! Woohoo! <laughs> oh! Oh, Emily, I have an idea. Follow me. Okay. Here we go. much fun taking a break. But Emily, I'm ready for another experiment. All right, we are going to make oobleck. Oobleck, fun. Yes. Oobleck is a non-Newtonian fluid and all you need for this, you can make this at home, is two parts cornstarch to one part water. Ooh. So let's go ahead and mix those in. Wow. Put your cornstarch in here. Okay. Go ahead. Cornstarch. Just like so. Good, <laughs> oh, good. It's snowing. <laughs> Whoa. Now, Add your water. Okay. Just like that. And you're gonna wanna just get your hands in here. <laughs> Whoa! This is really fun, mixing it up with your hands. And you said it was a non-Newtonian fluid? Yes, Whoa. so a non-Newtonian fluid is just a special name for a fluid that doesn't follow the normal fluid rules. Oh uh, yeah, so a normal solid has its own shape and a normal liquid or a fluid takes the shape of whatever container it's in. So if you have water in a cup, the water is shaped like the cup. <laughs> exactly, but oobleck, because it's a non-Newtonian fluid, sometimes acts like a liquid, but it sometimes acts like a solid, <laughs> depending on what we do to it. Oh, whoa, so are there other kinds of non-Newtonian liquids? Exactly, so one you might be familiar with is ketchup. Ketchup, yum! <laughs> I love that on my french fries. <laughs> <laughs> and when you're trying to get ketchup out of the bottle, what do you usually do? Mm, you normally need to tap the end of it a little bit. <laughs> exactly, because ketchup, when you hit it, when you add force to it, it acts more like a liquid. Oh! <laughs> and when you don't hit it, when you're not doing anything, to it, it acts mm -hmm. more like a solid and it's harder to get out of that glass bottle. Whoa, that's so interesting how it can be a solid sometimes or a liquid sometimes. Exactly, just <laughs> like Ublek. So watch this, when you squeeze it together, squeeze, 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 it acts like a ball. Whoa. But watch this, as soon as I stop squeezing it, it acts like a liquid flowing through my fingers. Whoa, it melts! <laughs> that's so cool! Whoa, and why is it called a non-Newtonian fluid? Yeah, That's a long name. <laughs> that is a long name. So Isaac Newton was a physicist and a mathematician, and Whoa. he set up some rules for fluids, and this doesn't really follow them. Mm -mm. It likes to break the rules. <laughs> yeah, and I've heard of Isaac Newton. That's so cool that he named this fluid. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, oh, I have an idea. How about you make a little ball again, oh. and I think our friend Mr. Elephant wants to play in the oobleck. Here we go. Woo! Uh oh, Whoa. he's getting stuck. <laughs> well, that's okay. Yeah, if he just moves around a lot, he doesn't get stuck. See, he's exactly. just walking over the oobleck. <laughs> if he stomps on the oobleck, he can stay on top. 
look! Stomp, stomp, stomp! Stomp, stomp, stomp! <laughs> yeah, but if he's not stomping, he'll sink like water. Here we go. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Ooh, black! <laughs> well, it looks like Mr. Elephant needs to go take another bubble bath. <laughs> Emily, this ooh like is super fun! Woohoo! <laughs> okay, Blippi, now that you know how ooh black works, I have a surprise for you. You have a surprise for me? Well, yep. where is it? Go ahead and slide down that slide. Okay, here we go! <laughs> <laughs> See you at the bottom! Woohoo! <laughs> This isn't ooh black, this is ooh blippy. <laughs> blippy, that's a corny joke. A corn starchy joke? <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> I had so much fun today. And it's so cool learning about non-Newtonian fluids, how they can be liquids, woo, or <laughs> solids. <laughs> oh, Emily, I had so much fun doing science experiments. Would you like a really big hug? Mm, maybe later, Blippi. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> I get that. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, can you spell my name with us? Okay, here we go. Ready? B-L-I-P-P-I. -I. <laughs> Blippi, good job. Well, I'll see you later. I need to get out of this ooplek. Woo! Whoa! 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 Ah! Ah! <laughs> Whoa! Yes! <laughs> hey, it's me, Blippi. And today, we are here at Cambridge Fieldhouse in Indianapolis, Indiana. <laughs> and I want to get some healthy exercise. Hey, why don't we play some basketball? I love basketball. Come on. <laughs> Look at where we're at. It's a basketball court. <laughs> yeah. Wow. I'm so excited to be playing basketball with you today. <laughs> yeah, I love basketball. <laughs> but I'm especially excited because this isn't a regular basketball court. It's a special one because the Indiana Fever practice here. <laughs> yeah. And look at their logo. Whoa. It is so colorful. <laughs> We have the color red, the color blue, the color white, and the color yellow. <laughs> Whoa, but do you see what I see? <laughs> yeah, it's the basketball hoop. Come on. Whoa. Look at it. <laughs> I can't believe we are so close to a basketball hoop that is shot at by the Indiana Fever. <laughs> Look, we have the hoop and the net, which hangs down. And look at the rectangle behind it. Yeah, the rectangle. That's called the backboard. And the shot clock. Woo! <laughs> I really want to play some basketball and make three pointers and layups. Whoa! It's professional basketball player Tamika Catchings. Hi, Tamika. Hi, I'm Blippi. Aw, <laughs> oh, wow. Would you like to play basketball together? I would love to play basketball with you. <laughs> Whoa, that would be so awesome. <laughs> but Tamika, is there anything we should do before we start playing? Of course, we need to stretch. <sighs> okay, let's start stretching. <laughs> well, what kind of stretches do you like to do before you play a game? Well, I always like to start off with my legs. Hey, I want to get my leg formed up, and then I want to get my arm formed up. So let's start with a, a short stretch, a small stretch. We'll have both of our legs together, feet together. Okay. And we're going to bend over from our waist. 
and try to touch the floor. Try to go as low as you can go. Whoa, look, I'm touching my toes. <laughs> and I love to count because counting is so important. So let's count to three. Okay, will you count to three with us? Okay, here we go. One, two, two three. three. <laughs> Whoa. Shake it out, shake it out. All right. <laughs> Good job stretching. <laughs> Play defense, your legs have to be spread apart, a little bit beyond shoulder width apart. Bend your knees and your arms out. All right, and your bottom half. Here we go. You ready for this? I'm ready. Flippy, are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? <laughs> Here Whoa. we go. Here we go. <laughs> We're gonna go side to side. Let me get over. We're gonna go okay. side to side. Here we go. Cross the paint. Ready? Here we go. One. <laughs> Two, let's go one more time. Three. Whoa! <laughs> Three defensive slides. That was awesome! <laughs> I think we're just about ready to learn more about playing basketball. <laughs> but is there anything else we're missing? Well, looking at our outfit, we need to get changed. <laughs> you ready for this? I'm ready. Here we go! Whoa, Tamika, you look great! You look amazing! Whoa! <laughs> we look all ready to play with the basketball! <laughs> Whoa! Well, what should we do first? Well, I think we should. We'll start with dribbling, then we'll go to passing, and then we will finish with shooting! Yeah! Oh, I love shooting! Woo! I like Swish. that form, Libby. I like that form. Uh -huh. Okay, so how should we dribble? Well, I think the most important thing, when you start with dribbling, you have to use your finger pad, not your palm, but your finger pad, all right? <laughs> so we're gonna do three dribbles with our right hand using our finger pad. Snap your wrist. You ready for this? Let's do it. All right. Here we go. One, two, three. Whoa! And we did it with our right hand, so now we should try it with our left hand. <laughs> okay, here we go. One, two, three. <laughs> Great. Oh, I love those dribbles. Okay. Love dribbling. You want to try something a little bit fancy? Yeah. Let's try something really fancy. All right, <laughs> we're going to do this really fast, but we're going to do crossovers. So we're going to not just keep it in one hand. We're going to go from one hand to the other hand, the other hand, the other hand. Okay. We'll try it. Five times. Five times? Five times. <laughs> okay. Five times. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three, four, five. Good job, Blippi. Whoa! <laughs> Dribbling is so fun. Now it's time to move on to passing. I'm ready. All right. I'm going to step, step, bounce. Whoa. Step, bounce. Good job, Blippi. <laughs> Whoa! This is fun! <laughs> and notice when you dribble or when you bounce the ball, it does not bounce right directly in the middle. It's a little bit beyond the middle part, all right? So, okay. got to come right up. Boom. One more, Blippi. One more. Good Whoa, job. You that was fun! Go at this. <laughs> and pass. <laughs> okay, here we go. Step and pass over our head. <laughs> Good job, Blippi. Ooh. Whoa, I like this one. You do? Why do you like this path? It's really fun. <laughs> Feels like there's a lot of power in your arms when they're above your head. And you can and pass it really you have hard. big muscles too, so <laughs> that is our overhead path. Wow, so we did dribbling and we did passing. Hmm, what else did we forget? And we did defense. And defense. Shooting! Oh. <laughs> How can we forget shooting? Ooh, ooh, look at that form. All right, so I always like to say when I come to the gym, I want to start close. Okay. Okay, so we're going to start kind of close. All right, just getting the form together. Same thing, you talked about the finger pads on the dribble. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm going to do the same thing when we shoot. All right, so on the pad. Whoa! In the hoop. <laughs> Swish! <laughs> Didn't even use the backboard. Well, we're kind of close, so this is all about form shooting and okay. getting your form together. Ooh, can I try it? Of course you can. Okay, I'll try it over here on the left side. So, take my hand like this. Put it on your finger pads. There finger you go. Pads. And how should my arm be here? It should be 90 degrees. Okay. Got oh. the 90 degree angle? Yeah. And then you have your other, yep, right there. Oh, and just like an L. <laughs> That was Whoa. great! Good job, Blippi! I made it! Well, 
What other kind of shots can we take? Hmm, well, you know what? Let's do a jump shot. So if you okay. stay right there, I will come up here and we'll do a jump shot. Most of the time when you get into a jump shot, it is about jumping. Obviously, <laughs> you gotta jump off the floor to shoot the shot. Okay, here we go. Are you First, ready? a chest pass. Whoa, switch! <laughs> okay, and now it's my turn. Okay, here you you wanna go, go on the same side? Yeah, I'm gonna go on the same side over on the right. All right, you ready? Chest pass into a jump shot. Okay, here we go. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> uh oh, I missed, but that's okay. You just need a little more practice. <laughs> Let's take one more shot. Okay, I think you can do it. You ready? Try it again. Let's go, Blippi. Are you cheering, Blippi? On? Come on, Blippi. <laughs> All right. Oh! <laughs> Whoa! You <I> went in! <laughs> You're so silly. <laughs> well, are there any other types of shots that we need to learn about? Well, I think it's important because not everybody gets to shoot out there. So sometimes you have to be able to shoot closer to the basket. I like the post up into a hook shot. Ooh, what's a post-up into a hook shot? Well, most of the time, if you're one of the taller players, but even some of our guards get down here. We got the mean guards. <laughs> All right? If you get down, you take the ball, dribble, and a hook shot is when you take the ball over your head and hook it into the basket. Oh, All right? okay. Well, the ball goes into the basket. Then... Whoa! <laughs> Whoa, that was really that good. Was awesome and great defense. Oh, I tried. I had my hands up. <laughs> Okay. All right, are you ready? I'm ready. All right, you want to try it? So, for a hook shot, what's the first thing I need to do? Well, the first thing, so most of the time you're going to post up, right? So you're going to be facing that way. Good okay. job, all right? Facing, facing this that way? way. So then the ball is going to come to you. And I like to say, when the ball comes to me, I like to dribble, one dribble. You might need to do two dribbles. I okay. step with my left, my right leg comes up, and then I hook it in. Okay. All right, you ready to try it? I'm ready to try it. All right, here we go, Blippi. Let's go, let's go, Blippi. Okay, first, I'll post up, and then dribble two times, step in, and <laughs> hook shot. But again, I need a little more practice. <laughs> let's try that it again. Your that's your first time, though. Yeah, yep. that was my first time. So if you miss on your first time, that's okay. You can just try again. <laughs> here we go. Remember, post up, dribble, dribble, dribble step, Oh! <laughs> well, uh oh! Maybe I need a little more practice than two times. Wow! Tamika, you are a really good basketball coach. Thanks, <laughs> Well, we learned dribbling, and passing, and shooting, and I made a layup. <laughs> well, I think we're ready to play a game. Well, what do you think about playing horse? Whoa! I love the game horse. Do you know how to play horse? <laughs> well, it's a game where one person makes a shot. And if they make it, the other person has to make the same shot. <laughs> but if they miss, they get a letter. And the first person to spell the word, they lose. <laughs> you don't want to spell the word. Hey, instead of playing horse and spelling horse, let's play Blippi and spell my name. Ah, you know what, Blippi? You are so creative. I love that. <laughs> Thanks. Well, let's play. So I've also been thinking, You've been practicing all day, and you are looking so much better. I think you're ready for the big show. The big show? <laughs> Let's meet today's players. Well, we just take the orange and blue. Your friend, Lippy! And they see the Memorial Basketball Hall of Famer, four time Olympic champion, and Indiana Fever legend, Tamika. Right side, right hand layup. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna start on the right side and do a right hand layup. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I made it. Okay, there you go. All now right, it's Tamika's turn. Left side. Let's go off the backboard. Okay. Ooh, <laughs> that's a little tricky. <laughs> 
left side, and now off the backboard. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Good job for me! No letters yet. Let's keep playing. <laughs> All right, let's go for a free throw. Well, what's a free throw? Well, a free throw, a shot, right? It's a free shot that you normally get in the middle of the game. Oh. Somebody fouls you. Put your arm out, you're shooting. I shoot, you hit my arm, oh. the foul, I get to go to the free throw line. Uh oh, I made a foul. <laughs> Whoa, swish! <laughs> Tamika's really good at that. <laughs> Let's see if I can make it, because I don't want to get a letter. <laughs> uh, uh oh, <laughs> I missed it. So that means I get the letter B. Yeah. B for Blippi. <laughs> Good dribble. We've been working on it. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> I hope I make it. <laughs> oh, uh oh, I missed again. That means I get an L. <laughs> okay, here goes Tamika. All right, Blippi, we're gonna bring it in a little bit, okay? <laughs> Thanks. Try to make it easy. Off the backboard. Mm -hmm. If you can hit that, you know what a backboard is? Yeah, the backboard. That's that big rectangle behind the hoop. <laughs> All right. Oh, okay. Here we go. Good job, Blippi. Yeah, we made it. Wait, don't get a letter. <laughs> Woo. Maybe we can try a silly shot. Oh. Let's try behind the backboard. We can try it. I don't want to break the clock, though. Well, that's okay. <laughs> Don't hit the clock. Whoa! Oh, Uh-oh. I got a miss. I got to go after you. OK. Now I get to pick what kind of shot we make. Hmm. Maybe a silly shot behind the back. Here we go. Woo. Oh! Whoa! I made it. Good oh, that job, was a Blippi. really tricky shot. That was good. <laughs> OK. Here we go. Oh! oh. Uh -oh. I got a B. <laughs> Okay, so Tamika has a B, and I have a B and an L. <laughs> okay, let's keep playing. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Tamika's really good at playing basketball. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that's okay. It's okay to miss a shot, because you can just take another one. But that also means I get an I! B. L I. <laughs> How about underhand? We're gonna go to the NBA three-point line. This <sighs> we're gonna go underhand though. Okay. Granny style. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. Here we go. <laughs> oh, a little bit too hard. <laughs> okay. Now I'm gonna try the same shot because it's a pretty tricky one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Maybe we can make an even bigger shot. Ooh, maybe if we back up to half court, we can make a really, really, really big I shot. I like it. <laughs> okay, let's keep backing up. Here we go. Here we go, Blippi. Ah! <laughs> Whoops, <laughs> I missed. <laughs> this one is extra tricky. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Good job. Ooh. <laughs> you're getting good at this. Oh. Practice. Well, Practice. You, you're a really good coach, too. <laughs> oh, Whoa. no! Uh oh! <laughs> I got a B L. A B L. And I have a B L I. Oh, it's getting really close. It's... Kind of. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're going to do a right handed hook shot. Okay, a right-handed hook shot. <laughs> Whoa. But we're gonna get a pass from Boomer. Can I get a pass from Boomer? Yeah, let's get a pass from Boomer. <laughs> All right, Boomer. I'm open. Yes. Whoa! <laughs> Tamika made it. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna get a pass from Boomer. Gotta post up, post up. Well, that looked a little bit different than my shot. Oh no, I forgot something. <laughs> Did I do a hook shot? Mm -mm. Nope. <laughs> so I think I get another letter. I'll give you another chance. Oh, 
Another chance? Yeah. Oh, that's nice of you. Yeah. Thanks. Post up. Okay. Ooh. And do you remember the kind of shot that I need to make? A hook shot. Okay, here we go. Woo. Oh, <laughs> it was really close. <laughs> but I still get a letter. P. B. L. I. P. <laughs> Behind the backboard. Let's try it. Behind the backboard. I think we can get this one. You got it. Yay! Yay! Wow! Did you see that? Whoa! Oh. Okay, now it's my turn. Oh! oh. <laughs> uh oh, I missed again. That means I get another letter. P again. B L I P P. Uh, we're still missing one letter. <laughs> Let's keep playing. <laughs> Whoa! That was great! Okay, my turn. Your turn. Let's go, Blippi! Oh! Uh-oh! <laughs> uh -oh. I get another letter! And that means B-L-I-P-P-I! -P -P -I. Tamika wins! <laughs> uh, I think you look exhausted. You are sweating. We might need to take a hydration break. <laughs> yeah. Let's take a hydration break and get some water. <laughs> See you soon. <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> that was so much fun playing basketball and really tiring. <laughs> You're really good at basketball. You must have played for a really long time. <laughs> well, it takes a lot of practice. <laughs> well, when did you start playing? I started playing basketball when I was in third grade. Whoa. But I've been around basketball almost my whole life because my dad played in the NBA. Oh, your dad played basketball? <laughs> that sounds so fun. <laughs> my dad, my brother, my sister, my mom, and me. Whoa, that's great. <laughs> well, how did you get into basketball? Well, one of the main things, and one of the main reasons I played sports, I was born with a hearing disability, so I wear hearing aids. But when I was younger, I got made fun of. And so sports was where I could go and practice, and practice and get really, really good at something, so people couldn't make fun of me. <laughs> Whoa, that's so great, and really inspiring. <laughs> yeah, well, I think it's important to find your passion. Oh, basketball is my passion, and I know that all of you have your own passion. <laughs> oh, I have a passion too. I love to dance. <laughs> oh, and I do have one other question. If I wanted to get better at basketball, or maybe you want to become a professional basketball player, do you have any advice? I have a lot of advice, but I think the biggest thing is that you have to set a goal. And once you set a goal, you have to practice, practice, and practice until you get tired. But even more importantly, that you have to make good grades. Ooh, <laughs> that sounds really important. Making good grades, practicing, and setting a goal. <laughs> do you know what a goal is? Yeah, a goal is something you want to do. And then you work really, really hard to do that goal. <laughs> oh, well, I had so much fun playing basketball and exercising with you. But do you know another way that is really fun to exercise? Hmm. Dancing! <laughs> hey, Tamika, would you like to learn how to dance like me? Well, Blippi, I don't know. You're so good. But maybe I'll try my best. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it sounds good. Let's learn to dance. Ooh. Okay, the first thing you need to know to dance like me is... Yeah, get a, gotta get warmed up. So move around. Ooh. Ooh. Do some stretching. Oh, but we already played basketball and stretched, so we're all ready to dance. Woo! The second thing is you want to move your body just however you want, and you can even do dance moves. Maybe, you know, jiggly arms. <laughs> or, since we're playing basketball, dribbly arms. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! I'm dribbling basketballs! <laughs> wow, that's fun. <laughs> Are you ready to dance together I'm, for real? I'm always ready. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Time to dance! <laughs> That was so much fun dancing! <laughs> Great Whoa. job, Tamika! Thank you, Blippi. <laughs> yeah. I'm tired! Oh, I'm tired, too. Woo! I had a really good time with you today. Uh, I had a really nice time with you. Thanks so much for teaching me so many things about basketball and for being my coach. Oh, I've 
don't know what to say. Uh, I might start blushing. Oh, <laughs> that's so nice. Oh, well, maybe we should try one more shot. You ready for it? I'm ready. All right, here we go. <laughs> you made it! <laughs> Whoa! I can't believe we got to play basketball with Tamika Catchings! <laughs> and we had a really fun day, learning about stretching and exercising and being really healthy. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. <laughs> hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Great! B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi. Good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Oh, hey, it's me, Blippi. Hi, and I'm Mika. Yeah, and look at where we're at. Yep, we're at Triple Play Family Fun Park. In Hayden, Idaho. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of fun indoor games here. Yeah, and I actually heard that they have bowling. Yes, I love bowling. Me too, let's go. Oh, hey, what's your name? My name's Eva. Oh, oh. nice to meet you. I'm Blippi. Hi, I'm Mika. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you too. What do you do here? Well, I work at the front bowling counter. Oh, oh cool. <laughs> well, we were actually wanting to go bowling. Is that possible? Yeah, of course. Let me get you guys set up on a lane. And then you're also going to need some shoes. Oh, oh I think yeah. these will fit you guys. <gasps> Thank Ooh, you. Perfect. Oh, Whoa. yeah, bowling shoes. Yeah, look at how smooth they are on the bottom. Yeah, they're really smooth so you can slide around when you're bowling. Oh, <laughs> yeah. And then you don't bring any dirt from your shoes onto the floor. Yeah, everyone has to wear bowling shoes. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. You're welcome. You guys have fun. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Shall we pick a ball? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Whoa, look wow. how colorful they are. Yeah. Oh, look. Yellow. One Whoa. of my favorite colors. Whoa, cool. Yeah. Ooh, and look at the number. Oh, this is the number nine. Oh, yeah. And look at this one. Ooh, red. Yeah. Oh, and it says... 11 on it. Huh. Huh. I wonder if that's the weight. Yeah, I think you might be right. Here, let's see. Okay, let's trade. Okay. Nine, this is 11. Oh, yeah, this one feels heavier than that one. Yeah, and the nine does feel a lot lighter. Yeah. <laughs> so it must be the weight. That's right. <laughs> okay, here you go. Here's okay. your nine back. Oh, thank you. <laughs> okay, let's see. What else? Ooh, Whoa. blue, one of my two favorite colors. Yeah. Ooh, and it has a 10 on it. Oh, so it must be 10 pounds. Yeah. I'm going to keep looking around, right, though. Let's see. Oh, look at this red one with the number seven on it. Whoa. Yeah. Cool. Does that feel pretty good? Yeah, this feels good. I think this is the one I'm going to use to go bowling. Okay. <gasps> Whoa. Yeah, orange, my other favorite color. Yeah. Ooh, and it has a 13 on it. Whoa, 13 pounds. It's really heavy. You want to feel? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, this would be too heavy for me. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to use that one. You're so, then... so strong. <laughs> Thanks, Mika. <laughs> yeah, I plan for it to hit the pins, and the pins will go because it's so heavy. Oh, I can't wait to see. <laughs> Shall we go play? Yeah, let's go. All right. <laughs> Oh, cool. Oh. This is going to be so much fun. Yeah. Ooh, I like how they're all lit up. Yeah, it's so <laughs> colorful. Yeah. Whoa, who should go first? Oh, you go. Okay. <laughs> all right. All right, check this out. Come on. All right, <laughs> good luck, Flippy. Whoa. Whoa. Did you see that? Here, come here. Yeah, I got some of the pins. Yeah, those white things way down there, those are the pins, and the goal is to try and knock them down. Whoa, cool. <laughs> okay. Did you see that? I saw that. You knocked a lot over. Ah, oh, thanks, Mika. Good job. All right, your turn. <laughs> All right, here I go, lane number four. Whoa, I got nine pins down. <laughs> There's 10 pins and you want to knock all of them down. So now I have one left to knock down. It's so fun. Whoa, Whoa. good job, Mika. Thanks, Blippi. You got way more than I did. Whoa. All right, my turn next. All right, you Come got on. this. Thanks. <laughs> all right, here we go. Oh, yeah, I 
I didn't get all of them. Hey, and did you check this out? Yeah, down here, these are the gutters. Yeah, the gutters and the lane. You wanna make sure it goes in the center and not in the gutters or else you'd get zero if it was in the gutters. <laughs> cool. All right, Mika, your turn. Blippi, did you see how our balls come right back? Oh yeah, yeah. that's really cool. This is called the ball return. Ooh, sweet. Oh, I have All right. one. Good luck. Thank you. Nope, no more pins. <laughs> My turn next. Here, I wanna show you something first. <laughs> you see this? Yeah, it's the number three and then her lane, yeah, is the number four over yeah. there. Cool. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, we're using different lanes. All right, shall I go? Yep, good luck, Blippi. <laughs> Thanks, Mika. All right, I'm gonna use the ball to hit the pins, and I'm gonna try and make sure the ball doesn't go in the gutter. All right, here we go. <laughs> I hit all the pins down on my second throw. If I got it on my first throw, that would be called a strike. Yeah. Hey, Mika. Yeah. Yeah, you know how you said that this is the ball return? Yep. Have you ever thought, how does the ball get all the way from back there to here? You're right, there's my ball and it comes back so fast. Huh, I wonder how the ball comes here. You should go check it out. I'll throw my ball down again and you can see how it comes back. That sounds like fun. All right, All right. see ya. <laughs> Whoa, this place is awesome. Yeah, this is definitely behind the chutes of the bowling alley. Hey, I got special permission to climb up there and check it out. Hey, come on. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa, cool. Whoa. <laughs> awesome. Look, do you see the pins down there? Yeah, there's definitely 10 pins right there. Ooh, interesting. Yeah. All the pins are attached by strings or ropes or whatnot. Oh, and it's so colorful. Okay, I'm gonna throw my bowling ball down the lane and then Blippi can see how it comes back. All right, here we go. Oh, did you see that? Yeah! The ball that Mika threw just came right there. Whoa! The pins are getting reset. I have to take some pictures for Mika. Whoa! And did you see how the ball went through that gate? Yeah, it looks like a door. That was really cool. All right. I have to show these pictures to Mika. She's gonna think they're so cool. <laughs> oh, oh, Mika, hey, Mika, it was so cool back there. Really, what did you learn? Yeah, well first there's the 10 pins. Yeah? Yeah, and then when you threw the bowl, it hit some pins and then they all fell down. Uh-huh. Yeah, and actually the pins are attached to this what? machine with rope and string. Oh, interesting. Yeah, and then it pulls them up straightens them down, and sets them back down gently. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. And then the ball, <laughs> it's on a slope right here. Uh -huh. Yeah. So the ball goes down the slope and then into this gate door, and then it flings back to you. What? That's yeah. so cool. Yeah. I actually took some pictures oh. for you. You like oh, it? Oh, I see. Cool, huh? Wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow, really well, neat. Shall we play some bowling? Yeah, let's keep playing. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Whoa! All, All right. right. Good luck. Okay, you too. <laughs> Whoa! Ah! Oh, almost <laughs> a strike. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Two nice. Pins. Thanks, Whoa. <laughs> yeah, you almost got it. <laughs> yeah, so close. <laughs> cool. Oh, looks like my ball's back. Here's yours. Whoa, all right, all right, here I go. Go, Blippi. <laughs> Whoa, so close again. <laughs> all right, here we go. Oh, I have three pins left. <laughs> oh, wait, Mika, look. I have three <gasps> pins left too. No way. Yeah, 
we got the same pins knocked down. Yeah, we knocked down seven pins. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's throw them at the same time to see if we both get spares. Good idea. <laughs> okay. All right, are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> Three, Three, two, two one. Oh, I got zero. And I got two. Yeah, good job. Good job. Oh. A spare! Oh, I also call that a spare! All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, so close! Good at bowling too. Oh, thanks. <laughs> now it's really interesting how different bowling balls are different weights. Yeah, and they have the number right on the ball so you know how heavy it is. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. And it's so cool how there's 10 pins. Yeah. And if you get all 10 of them down on your first throw, it's a strike. And if you get them all down on your second throw, it's a spare. Yeah. <laughs> well, I sure do love bowling. Yeah, especially with you, Blippi. Aw, you too, Mika. Aww. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video. But if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Mm -hmm. Will you spell my name with us? Yeah. <laughs> B-L-I-P-P-I. -P -P -I. Blippi, good job. <laughs> Will you spell my name with us? Cool. <laughs> okay. M-E-E-K-A-H, Mika. <laughs> All right, see you again. Bye-bye. See you later. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> hey, it's me, Flippy. And today, we are here at Sun Buggy Fun Rentals in Las Vegas, Nevada. And I am so excited because we get to learn all about different kinds of vehicles <laughs> that go really, really fast. And if we're lucky, maybe we can even drive one. <laughs> Come on, let's go explore. This place. What's Hi. up, Blippi? Hi, what's your name? I'm Matt. Nice to meet you. Oh, it's nice to meet you. Whoa! And what is this vehicle you're working on? Right here we have a dune buggy. Whoa, a dune buggy? Well, why do you call it that? We actually specifically designed these machines for the dunes, for hills, bumps, and jumps. <laughs> Whoa, I love hills, bumps, and jumps. <laughs> this vehicle is awesome. Whoa, and <laughs> check it out. It has a really big wheel and tire. <laughs> yeah. And you see, this tire has lots of really big treads to grab the sand and the dirt so it can go really fast up those hills, bumps, and jumps. <laughs> and also has shocks. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, and check it out. It's also my favorite color. One of my two favorite colors, orange. <laughs> uh, but Matt, this looks a little different from a regular car. I can see through it. <laughs> we actually make it like that so the roll cage keeps you safe and you have fun. Whoa, that's always good. Be safe when you're having fun. <laughs> Whoa, and look at this. It's the engine. 
Whoa! <laughs> it's so big! Looks like this dune buggy can go really fast. <laughs> These dune buggies can go 35 miles an hour in the sand. Whoa! 35 miles per hour in the sand? <laughs> That's really fast. <laughs> well, I really wish I could ride one of these dune buggies. <laughs> well, do you want to go out to the desert and try one? Would I? That would be awesome! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Look at this place! It's so big! <laughs> and really sandy and sunny. <laughs> Matt, where are we? We're in the Mojave Desert. Whoa! The Mojave Desert? Awesome! <laughs> It sure is sandy here. And it looks like there are lots of hilly sand and looks like sand everywhere, really. <laughs> yeah, those hills are sand dunes. Oh, sand dunes? Did someone make them? Nope, just nature, wind and sand. Oh, that's so cool. Wait a minute, sand dune, dune buggy. Do we get to ride on the sand dunes? Just you today. <laughs> awesome! I am so excited to ride on a sand dune and drive a dune buggy. Whoa! Check it out! Look at all these vehicles! <laughs> hey, I know this one. It's a dune buggy. Mm, but Matt, what are th what's this vehicle over here? This one over here? Yeah. This is a UTV, a utility vehicle. Whoa, a UTV, awesome. It looks kind of like a dune buggy. It has four wheels. One, two, three, four, but you can't see through it. <laughs> and it looks a little bit different. It also has uh, one of these. What's it has a called? roll cage, just like the dune buggy. Oh, cool, a roll cage, so it's nice and safe. <laughs> uh, but Matt, what's this back here? Is this this is, trunk? <laughs> this is a bed like a truck. Whoa, that's really handy. So I guess if you're on a farm and you need to put tools in it, yeah. you have a trunk. So Ooh, yeah. That's pretty cool. Oh, hey, and check it out. There's another vehicle over here. Huh. Whoa. <laughs> this one is our ATV. This is an all-terrain vehicle. ATV, all-terrain vehicle. <laughs> awesome. Whoa. It's a little bit smaller than the other two, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it looks super fast <laughs> and has four wheels, but Matt, it doesn't have a steering wheel. No steering wheel? These are called handlebars. Whoa, just like a motorcycle or a bicycle? <laughs> this looks pretty fun, but I want to ride the dune buggy over the dunes. <laughs> I'm also really excited to ride it because it's one of my two favorite colors, orange. <laughs> okay, Matt, I think I'm all ready to start driving, but What's the first thing I need to know before I drive the dune buggy? The first rule for driving dune buggies is always safety. Safety first. <laughs> okay, I want to be really safe, so what's the first safety thing I need to know? So we're going to get you inside of the dune buggy and we're going to put your seat belts on first. <laughs> okay, seat belt first. All right, so the first thing we're going to do is get your seat belt on. Awesome. Here we go. And this buckle here is going to connect your two seat belts. <laughs> Whoa. Here we go all strapped in. So what's the next thing I need? Next, and this dune buggy is going to be your hand straps. These okay. keep your hands inside of the ride at all times. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Great. Okay. And, uh, but how do I drive the dune buggy? So this dune buggy is automatic, just like a car. Ooh, uh, so where do I put the key? <laughs> no key today. <laughs> you just have a switch and a button. Okay. So when you're ready to go, switch goes up, you hit that button, and you're good to go. <laughs> okay, I'm all ready to go. <laughs> First, let's get your helmet, okay? Okay, we'll put on the helmet. <laughs> Woohoo! Okay, helmet on. All right, now, make sure your helmet is strapped tight. Pull the strap through the loop. Perfect. Oh, and goggles! <laughs> okay. We want to put on our goggles so we don't have any sand in our eyes. <laughs> It looks like I'm all ready to go. All right. Have fun, Blippi. Woohoo! See you soon.
You did great. Yeah. <laughs> you want to try the ATV now? Yeah, come on. Let's, Let's try it out. All right, so this one, a little easier than the dune buggy to start. So you have your key on the right side there. Go ahead and turn your key for me. Okay. Key's on. All right, so now with that thumb, press that button there for me. This one right here? Yep. Okay. Whew. And where's the gas pedal? So, where your thumb is, that's your gas pedal. Okay, here we go. We rode the dune buggy and the ATV. You want to try the UTV? Yeah! All right, don't forget your seatbelt, just like your car. Here we go. And this one is like the ATV. Turn your key to the right, and it'll go ahead and start. Okay. Right. Have fun. Here we go. Bye-bye. <laughs> Hear that? Do you know what kind of vehicle makes that sound? <laughs> yeah! A truck or a car! Hey, for this next song, let's dance like we're driving a car! Hit the gas, hit the gas, hit the brake, hit the brake, hear the engine, hear the engine, do a figure eight. To go fast, you wanna put your foot down and hit the gas. If there's something ahead and you need to make a sudden stop, then hit the brake. It's alright and it's okay. Make sure that you look both ways with your hand at nine and your hand at one. Let's go for a drive, let's have some fun. Hit the gas, hit the gas, hit the brake, hit the brake, hear the engine, hear the engine, do a figure eight. From the mirrors on my car From behind I can see very far This is important if I need to break Or especially when I overtake It's alright and it's okay We take it at our own pace One hand at ten, the other at two Go for a ride, you know what to do Hit the gas Hit the gas Hit the brake Hit the brake Hear the engine Hear the engine Do a figure eight
with some good driving. I had so much fun with you here at Sun Buggies in Las Vegas, Nevada. And we learned so much together. We learned all about ATVs, UTVs, and dune buggies. <laughs> well, this is the end of this video, but if you wanna watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? Okay, B-L-I-P-P-I, -P -P -I. Lippy, good job. Well, I'll see you soon. Let's ride! <laughs>so good to see you man yeah thanks for coming out is this your race car sure is whoa it looks so fast and really cool 
And hey, do you notice something? <laughs> you have my name on it. You sure do, man, just for you. Ah, uh, thanks. Hey, will you spell my name with me? Can we do it? Yeah. All right. Join in. Let's do it. Okay, here we go. B L I P P I. Flippy. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Whoa, there are so many cool parts. Can you tell us a little bit about the race car? I'd love to, Blippi. Why don't we start right here with the tires? Now, this race car's got four tires just like your car at home, but the tires are very different. You wow. notice how it's really smooth on top, no treads on it? Whoa. We call it a slick tire. That gives the race car more grip in the corners, which is obviously really important. <laughs> very special tires for these cars. And like the tires on your road car, well, they're gonna last you a while, six months, a year. These are only gonna last us for 25 laps. So we have to come in a lot and change tires all the time because they don't last very long. Whoa, that's a lot of tires and a lot of pit stops. <laughs> and a lot of money. A set of tires on your road car might cost you a couple hundred dollars. One of these tires is $1,500 and we've got four every time we come in. What? $1,500? <laughs> that's an expensive tire, <laughs> but it sure looks cool. Whoa. And this race car is really colorful. Do you know the colors on the race car? <laughs> yeah, we have the color yellow, the color red, the color blue, and the color white. <laughs> Let oh. me show you one of my favorite things, Blippi. So this is the steering wheel. Do you want to hold it? Yeah. Okay, so Ooh. it kind of looks like a video game. It's very different than your mom and dad's, you know, car steering yeah. wheel. It's got a lot of buttons. It's got a screen that gives you a lot of information about the engine, how Ooh. fast you're going. On the back, you have the shifters. So that's to go up, that's to go down. And this is the clutch. So oh. very, very complicated, very, very cool. Um, and it's it's all part of what makes a race car go as fast as they do. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, do you see that? Look, the shifters. <laughs> They're little, little switches on the back. Little switches, little paddles. Do you wanna little know what paddles. else makes the car go really fast? Yeah. James will show you up front. Come over here, Blippi. Here's oh, something I wanna show you. Hey, James. So you see this part right here? You yeah. don't see this on a road car, do you? Mm -mm. Nope, my this car is... doesn't have that. <laughs> <laughs> this is called the front wing. And what the front wing does is generate something called downforce. So what downforce is, is when the air pushes the car into the ground and it gives you more grip in the corners. So the faster you go, the faster the air hits this wing, the harder it pushes the car in the ground, the more grip you have. Whoa, that's really important. We don't want our race car to become an airplane. <laughs> no, we don't want it flying away. <laughs> We've talked a lot about what's, what makes a race car different than your car that you see on the road, but one of the things that's very similar is we have what's called an aero screen in IndyCar, and it's, it's basically a windshield. And it was designed and introduced in 2020 to help protect the drivers. You know, we go over 200 miles an hour with over 30 different cars on the racetrack with us at the same time, and sometimes accidents happen. And so the number one thing for, for the series and for the Indianapolis Motor Speedway is to protect the drivers and make it a safe sport. So this was a major introduction, the first in all of motor racing, to put a screen on an open wheel race car. So that's very, very similar to a windshield that you'd have on a road car. And then you also have mirrors. So this is so we can see what's behind us. Huh, that's so cool. Yeah, look at this. This is a really cool era screen. Very cool and very, <laughs> very strong. It can withstand up to six pickup trucks the weight of six pickup trucks on top of that, so incredibly what? strong. The weight of six pickup trucks? That's really heavy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well, Alex, I wanted to ask, since you have the aero screen, do you still have to wear a helmet? You do still have to wear a helmet. You know, ultimately, we're still driving in an open cockpit. You, you can see there's no roof on the top. So there are still potentials to have things come and hit your head, and as fast as we're going, you want to make sure you're as safe as possible. Safety first is really important. <laughs> Wow, well, thank you both for teaching us about all these different parts of this really cool race car. <laughs> of course, but I mean, it's not just about the car and the driver. There's a pit crew, too. Do you want to go meet them? I would love to go meet the pit crew. All right, let's go. Come on. Whoa, look at where we are. We're in the garage. <laughs> and I'm so excited to meet the pit crew. <laughs> Blippi, I want to introduce you to two of our mechanics. We got Brad and... Brad. Hey, nice to meet you, Blippi. Hi, Brad. Nice to so, meet Blippi, you. So, Blippi, the Brads are going to show you how to change a tire. Oh, whoa, Brad and Brad, they both have the same name. <laughs> That's so silly. <laughs> Brad, that would be really nice of you to show us how to change a tire. Sure can, Blippi. This is a wheel gun. You take the wheel gun, you put it on the wheel nut, pull the trigger, it comes off. You take the old tire, set it down, pick up a new tire, slam it on, change the gun, and you're done. Whoa, that was really fast. You take the wheel gun to 
take off the wheel nut to take off the tire really, really fast. <laughs> Brad, how fast can you change a tire? A good one is under five seconds. Whoa, under five seconds? Woo! <laughs> That's really fast. <laughs> well, do you think I could change a tire? Sure, I'm gonna have Brad, the other Brad, <laughs> help you. Oh, thanks, Brad. Oh, hi, Brad. <laughs> first thing you want to put on some gloves. Okay, first, we want to put on gloves. <laughs> Safety first. Safety. Whew. One glove and two gloves. <laughs> now that we have on our gloves, I think we can change the tire. Whoa! <laughs> That's really heavy. <laughs> I'll give it to Brad. <laughs> and we take the other tire, we put it on the race car. Now, we need to put the wheel nut back on the car. And here we go. Now, we put it back on. There you Ooh, go. There it is. <laughs> nice work. Whoa. Good job, Lippy. <laughs> Whoa, that was really hard. I did it a little bit longer than five seconds, but <laughs> I just need a little practice. <laughs> wow, that was so amazing. Well, Brad, what else does a pit crew do for a race car or a race car driver? The pit crew guys clean the car, build the car, make the car for the drivers each race weekend. Wow, that is so cool. Feels like they have a really important job to have a great race. <laughs> oh, and that reminds me, oh, what else do you need to do to get ready for a race? Well, Blippi, driving a race car is incredibly physical. You have four to five G-forces, which is four to five times your body weight pushing against you in either a forward and back motion or a side to side motion. So we do a lot of stretches, James and I, before we get into a race car to do a race. Sometimes the races are two to three hours long, so you wanna make sure your body's nice and warm and ready to go. So the first thing we focus on is our neck. You know, we have the helmet on, that weighs five or six pounds. We have a lot of load that's placed on our neck with all those deep forces. So let's just grab one side of our neck and, and kind of pull it gently to the side. And we'll do that for a couple seconds and then go to the other side. Wow. Just so wanna make sure you do it all. And then push on the back to kind of get the, the back of the neck warmed up, cool. and then push on your forehead and push, push against to get that, that part of your neck warmed up. So it's really good to help make sure that you, know, you don't get tired in the race. The next thing we can do, in, a, in an Indy car, there's no power steering. So the steering wheel is very heavy. Very it's very difficult to control the car. So you want to make sure that your shoulders and arms are warmed up. So we'll Probably needs really oh, strong arms too. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> for sure. So Whoa. forward, forward, backwards, yeah. yeah. Back. Whoa. You can make circles with us too. Whoa! <laughs> and the last thing you do is, you know, you are sitting for for a long period of time, right? So you want to make sure that your legs are as warmed up as possible. So okay. what we can do is we can do a couple. We can either do jumping jacks or we can do lunges, James. What do you think we should do? I think we should try a lunge. Try Thanks a lunge. Okay, yeah, here we go. You can lunge with us too. Okay, here we go. Step forward. Here we go. Switch, switch legs. That's good guys. Make sure you get both of them. Yeah, do Ooh. one more. All right, so now you warmed up your legs. Good job. Your arms <laughs> and your neck. So you're ready to drive a race car. Love it. Ready to drive a race car. But I think there might be something else I'm missing. There are a couple rules when you drive the race car, and so you have to make sure you know those rules. And those okay. are really based around the flags. Now the flags all have different colors, so I'm gonna go grab those flags and I can show you what each one means, okay? Okay, all right. I'll see you soon. Whoa. There's a lot that goes into having a really good race. I'm really excited to see all these flags and what all the colors mean. <laughs> so here we go, here's a couple flags. First one right here, what color is this, Blippi? Whoa, this is the color red, <laughs> a red flag. The red flag is when there's a stoppage in the race, and that happens if we have bad weather or a bad accident that they need to clean up. Okay. I'll hold it for you. Thanks. Next, we have the yellow flag. Ooh, yellow flag. Yellow <laughs> means caution, either in the corner or on the whole track. If there's just one car that's maybe off track, you've got to slow down and be cautious in that corner. But then once you're past that corner, you can move on to hopefully <gasps> see this one. I know this flag. The green flag. <laughs> yeah, the green flag. And I bet I know what this means too. Let's hear it. It's okay to go as fast as you can. As Woo! fast as you can. That's the one that everybody really loves seeing at the start of a race. But at the end of a race, this one's my favorite. This is the checkered flag. Whoa! And if you see this one first, it means the race is over and you won. Whoa! 
the checkered flag. <laughs> that means this is a really important flag. And one day, I hope I can see it if I win the race. <laughs> Woo! Hey, Blippi, I've got an idea. How about I show you what it's like to win the Indianapolis 500? <gasps> you would? Yeah. I would love to find out what it's like. All right, follow me. Okay. Let's go follow Alex and see what it's like to win the Indianapolis 500. <laughs> see you soon. Woo! Whoa, look at where we are. <laughs> Flippy, do you know what this is? Whoa, this is it. The Borg Warner Trophy in real life. <laughs> so the Borg Warner Trophy uh, was created in 1936 and every single winner of the race, their face is engraved onto the trophy. <laughs> Whoa, look, there's lots of little faces. <laughs> they're right here. Wow, and they're from so many different years. Hey, look, it has their name and the year that they won and their average miles per hour. <laughs> the average, average miles per hour for the whole 500 miles. And so while we're down here, Louis Meyer in 1936, when he won the Indy 500, he requested a glass of ice cold buttermilk when he got out of the race. <laughs> but buttermilk. We've, we've kept that as a tradition. And now every single year, the winner gets a glass of milk. Oh, that sounds like a good tradition. Do you know what a tradition is? <laughs> yeah. A tradition is something that has been done for a really long time and it's important, so we keep doing it. <laughs> Sounds like there's lots of traditions if you win. So here's your glass of milk, as if you won the race. It's not buttermilk, keep in mind, but it's kind of cool, it's kind of special. You're at the victory podium, you have a glass of milk. It's almost like you won the race. <gasps> it's almost like I won the race! Flippy wins! <laughs> Time to drink the victory milk! <laughs> Here we go. Like a pro. <laughs> Woo. Excuse me. <laughs> and the next thing that you get if you win the race is, well, because this trophy is five and a half feet tall, it's worth over two to three million dollars. It's worth a lot of money. They give you a miniature version of the Borg Warner Trophy called the Baby Borg, which you get to take home with you and keep it at your house. <gasps> Whoa! I can't believe I'm holding a real Borg Warner Trophy. A miniature one. <laughs> wow, it is so beautiful has wings on the side, <laughs> and it looks like it's made of actual real silver. <laughs> oh, thanks, Alex. You're welcome. Thank you so much for coming and learning about the Indianapolis 500 and the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, and we really hope to have you come back next year so you can see the race in person. Whoa, I would love to come see the race in May. <laughs> it sounds so fun and exciting. <laughs> thanks for teaching us about all these different things. Absolutely, it was so nice to meet you. Enjoy the rest of your time here, and I can't wait to see you again. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Bye, Bye Alex. <laughs> Wow, can you believe it? We met an actual professional race car winner and someone who won the Indy 500. <gasps> I'm so excited. <laughs> hey, maybe we can keep exploring and learn some more things about the racetrack or another race car. <laughs> Come on. Look at what we found. <laughs> well, right now we're inside turn one at the garages and it looks like we found a race car. <laughs> Not just a race car, but a race car driver. <laughs> well, I've had so much fun learning about racing and racetracks with you. <gasps> Maybe we can ask them about being a race car driver and learn even more. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> Whoa, it's professional race car driver, Sarah Fisher. <laughs> Hi, Sarah, I'm Blippi. Hi, Blippi, nice to meet you. Well, it's really nice to meet you. <laughs> We've been learning all about racing and being race car drivers. <laughs> What's it like being a race car driver? It's a lot of fun, but it is sure a lot of work. <laughs> well, it sure looks like fun. We love going really fast, <laughs> running, driving. <laughs> well, have you been a race car driver for a really long time? I have. I started in go-karts when I was just four years old. Oh, four years old? Riding a go-kart? <laughs> I love go-karts. Hey, have you ever ridden a go-kart before? <laughs> uh, but this looks a little different from a go-kart. This is really a big race car. Whoa, look at it. It has really big wheels and tires. Wow, all kinds of parts to it. <laughs> oh, Sarah, do you have a favorite part to the race car? Oh, absolutely. I have many, but one of my favorites is the rear view mirror. It was actually developed here at Indianapolis Motor Speedway in 1911, the first race. Whoa, 1911, that's a long time ago. <laughs> Yeah, you see? Look, it 
has a rear view mirror, just like your car. So if you're driving along, <laughs> you can look in the mirror and see what's behind you. This one looks different from the other race car we saw. It has two seats. <laughs> one, two, two seats. <laughs> hey, what's the second seat for? Well, this car is purposefully built so that I can give people a ride and they can see just how fast an indie car can go. <laughs> Whoa, that sounds really, really fun. <laughs> well, I've never been in an Indy car before, but they sound really fast. Well, what's it feel like to be in an Indy car? Do you get really nervous or shaky because you're bumping along really fast? <laughs> well, just like any other sport, sure, you can get a little nervous, but once you're in the car, all buckled in, it's time to go. <laughs> Whoa, that's so cool. And this car is really colorful too. Oh, do you know what colors the race car is? Yeah, look the color green and the color blue. <laughs> Dark blue. <laughs> wow, this is a really cool race car. I wish I could drive in it. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, because it has a second seat, why don't you come for a ride with me and see what it's like? Me ride with you in a race car? You bet. <laughs> yeah, I would love to ride. <gasps> Whoa, do you think I should ride in the race car? Okay, we'll have to do it. Well, let's go get a uniform and a helmet and get buckled up and ready to go. Okay, great. <laughs> Time to get suited up. Wow, it even has a bow tie. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're all suited up. Let's go! Come on! <laughs> hmm. I wonder where Sarah went. <laughs> Good thing I have my binoculars. <laughs> I don't see her anywhere. I think I hear something. Oh, I see something! Whoa! That was really, really fast! <laughs> I can't wait for her to come around again! I think it's time for us to ride! Come on! Hello! <laughs> Whoa! We're up so high! <laughs> Whoa! 
today was awesome. Here at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway, <laughs> we learned all about racetracks, race cars, and even got to meet some professional race car drivers. <laughs> Sarah Fisher, James Hinchcliffe, and the winner of the 100th running of the Indy 500, Alex Rossi. <laughs> well, that's the end of this video, but if you want to watch more of my videos, all you have to do is search for my name. Hey, will you spell my name with me? <laughs> Great! B-L-I-P-P-I! -I. Flippy! Good job! Well, I'll see you soon! <laughs> 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 Ring, 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 ring,